work. I'm going to be getting stuff to plug my laptop in, but at least got things up. I can at least see chat now. That is all that really matters. actually get started, although <laughs> a little bit later than I would have liked to have been. I blame the Popos and also the double kick that I had earlier. That was actually really good. Uh, hey, old British Brit, how's it going, man? Let's see. Headphones so I can actually hear the game. There we go. Ah, oh, there's that music that I love. Oh. You know, how's it going, man? Let's see, how are things going in Salomon? Uh, Salomon, again. Because I am trying to convert this area, and hopefully, if we convert over to Christianity, maybe things will go a little bit better. I'm good, you? I'm not doing too bad. Ugh. Oh. I had an interesting breakfast of fries and cheesecake, and uh, then I, when I got back home, a doppelkeg. Those things are really good. They're supposed to be a... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? They're supposed to be an authentic German snack, and I'm loving them so far. At least that's how they're marketed at Aldi, at least, and they're really good. I like them. They're like fancy, really fancy Oreos. But no, I'm doing pretty good myself, at least. I'm gonna hope that today in this stream that we don't fucking suck. And uh, I can actually kind of get us to build up our, our faction a little bit more instead of being stuck in just the British Isles. Because we can only do so much in just the British Isles. We can only do so much. And so I'm going to hope that Conan down here can continue building us up uh, a little bit more down here. Uh, we're going to, again, try and see if converting to Christianity is going to help us out a little bit. Public order-wise, technically it should. Um... This is the paganism unrest is going to be really bad for a little while until we can properly convert everything. Are there actually priests again in Barbarian Invasion? I believe there is. I just can't remember. Because you guys up here are just kind of chilling. You're not doing much. I'm not trying to... I'm just trying to build up over here. Still trying to send you over. Aha, now I can actually talk to them. Because I want to try and get... Let's try and just get trade first with the Huns. Mm, a most generous proposal. That does not sound like what I would expect the hunts to sound like. <laughs> but no, try and get trade, and then I want to get map information too. Uh, 50 dinars for 18 turns. That's actually not that bad. I'll take oh, it. thanks. Because I want to just have map information of all the stuff that you guys control. Why do you do this to me, Rebels? Why? I want a Royal Navy so I can keep kicking your asses, but I can't. Sure. God, they control a lot over here. Ridiculous amount. And let's see, is there actually a land bridge here? It doesn't seem like there is. Okay, so I'm going to go up this way. Because I want to get the map information from everybody else that there is in the world. Try and do that. Oh, you got stuck. Keep going around this way, man. Keep doing that. And I'm doing the plots. At least we're making a little bit more money now, this time. Hey, Jason, how's it going, man? Riding. Yeah, you guys riding down here. I'm too surprised about that. Actually, how many... Did they kill many of my own men? Nobody was harmed in this disaster. Good. Good, good, good. Because it's going to take us a little while to build this area up. Because right now, break down the leaves, it's still 2%. It's still not converting in our favor yet. The neighboring regions, characters in region, religious buildings. Because this will finish. Yeah, conversion 10%. The characters at least helping out 10% as well. Okay, it'll be a couple turns until this is actually getting there. There's a very close one. Let's see. The Suez declared war on me in my Thrace campaign. Oh no! How dare they do such a thing? How much money are we making? We're making 1900 per turn. Okay, that's not bad. As long as things keep up like that and I can kind of build myself up in Salamanca, Salamanca um, I think we'll be fine. Because I know this is controlled by, or it should be controlled by, the Ostrogoths right now, if I remember correctly. Unless they've grown anymore. Let's see. Uh... 
Territorial. Territorial, they've stayed the same, so yes. I could have sworn they were sieging this. I can't tell. But I just want to make sure that they don't go and claim Cordoba. Um, I need to at least claim that myself before we head out. So you guys, we need to just keep preparing that and keep building up this church. Because I think it should start converting now. Yes. So now it's going to actually start converting in our favor. Now we've got 20% instead of just 15. So that would start going into our favor a little bit. And public order should get a lot better. And then also, I can, I can retrain all my guys here. So let's do that. Slowly retrain them, please. Riding. Some soldiers were damaged. It's not too worse, though. East Roman Empire and the Berbers are now at war. Huh. Let's see, yeah, Ar uh, Arabia to Babylon to the conquest to India. Uh, said no one ever against a larger faction. <laughs> said, said yay, no one ever against a larger faction. Oh, that actually sounds really interesting, though. Like, if you win that, oh, that's going to be something to be really proud of. Let's bring you down here. I'd like to be able to retrain you at some point. Uh, see, these are all... Oh, here are the slobs! I will address them at once. Ha ha, you guys have actually started popping up now. Okay, well, I can't really do much with you. Uh, actually, I'm going to offer an alliance. We see no benefit to us. Damn it! Well, I thought I'd at least try. I'll keep bringing you guys down this way again. Uh, I'm going to take path blocked. Yeah, we, we already knew about that. Damien's people, they're on the move. I wonder what they're going to do. So I'm kind of curious how much they'll expand uh, with their stuff. Mm -hmm. Hey, Senko fam. Hey, I was just watching your uh, Thera Redux playthrough. Nice. How you like it, man? I know that's one of my older ones before I got all of my proper setups, but I, I know for myself I enjoyed that. Although I think that wasn't the Thera Redux. I think that was just the original Thera. Um, I need to actually go back and play the Thera Redux. I really do need to go back to that one at some, that mod at some point. It's been a very long time since I've done that mod. Let's see, you guys. Yeah, let's just. Because how much money am I making right now? Right now, I'm making about sixteen hundred. Um, I want to get you guys over here to a point where it's not going to be that bad, and I can just leave here, go down to Cordoba, because I need to conquer Cordoba. Maybe. What would it be like if I leave? Just like four of you. March. Oh, you're pissy. Okay, now we'll have to wait a little bit longer here. Let's see, unless Egypt or Carthage attack me or the Germans. Well, let's hope they don't attack you, Jason. I'm gonna hope that you can win that war. New family member. They've broken their alliances and they're not at war with each other. Yeah, I'm gonna let you guys keep just killing each other up there. Oh, also, Delradia grew up here. I can actually get something up. Let's have you get the better port. That should actually get a decent amount of money. 74, that's not that bad. Yeah, well, let's grab that for now. Uh, inactive settlements. I have no money for London yet, so I can't do anything. Let's see, had my blood news cannot is my Leave me alone! Fuck off, rebels! And there goes my faction later. Shit. Okay, um... Where was he again? Oh, he was up here. Yeah. Uh, I don't have any extra generals up here. Okay. Well, who's now my faction leader? Because I think it was the guy in Londinium. Yes. So, uh, Gortun, Gortun of Cornwall is now my faction leader. And who is my faction heir? Family tree. Right now, faction heir, Mansby. Okay, so it's actually you. You're my faction heir. And you're actually not that bad. Although, I just don't have many living family members. I have one, two, three, four. I have literally four living family members. <laughs> oh my god, so many of them have died. Let's so see, you got an army of... Uh, get a cat. Cavalry, archers, and or Divisian infantry, and... Fezzetaroi? Did you know Frederick the Great was 5'5", five, five, short king? I did not know he was that short. I did not know that. Yeah, I'm going to have to be very careful with my generals because I've lost so many recently. Okay, I'm going to save my money because I need to make sure next level... Because... With the size of this city, I can get to this one, and that one costs 3200 So, I'll make sure to try and grab that, or at least start that up. 
And then I think we might be able to leave here. Factionator dies. Yes, it is a sad, sad day. Or destruction. Okay. Leave me the fuck alone. At least it's not the rebels this time. Wait, how did I win? Okay. Oh, I'm not winning this one. Let's see, my faction leader in Barbarian Empire's campaign is 41, and the heir is his second brother. Huh. Oh, you're 6'4". Okay, so you're actually about similar to my hate, Jason. Yes. Who's this? This is the Franks. I'd like the, them to like me more, but I'll still go over here. Let's try and talk to the Assassins and the Roxolani. I'm going to try and get map information and trade with them. Also, has... Let's see, let me go back over here. I'm trying to just keep in uh, mind if you guys grow at all. Oh, you lost a city. Oh, what'd you lose? I'm going to hope it's this one. No, we still have control of this settlement. So you can still control this settlement. They might have lost something over here. Because I need more land, and eventually I have to actually conquer the land that they controlled. So eventually I'll have to go over there. Man, you guys are doing a lot better. You're a lot happier here. Good. Oh, I hate that I didn't convert to Christianity. Uh, oh. Will that block off the other one? No, it won't. Okay, so actually, that's a separate building. That just straight up adds public order bonus to happiness. And aids the spread of... Okay. So right now we've got 25. Okay, it's going better. 29 to 71. Although, we're going to just get this for now. We just need to help with conversion more. Does this help at all? It says it does. But we'd actually be able to get monks now. Chance inspiring nearby troops. Can swim, come in woods before versus... Okay. Well, he won a war. Let's see, my secondary school yeah, year, I was like the seventh tallest out of like 260 people. Maybe they don't remember it was like seven years ago. Oh wow! I know for myself in high school, um, I was the I was obviously I was the second tallest in my grade. Um, out of everybody there, I was the second tallest, and uh, it was pretty easily that I was the second tallest. There was not many people that close. Let's see. Um. How would you guys feel if I now leave? Well, let's retrain those guys and then try and get... I'm probably going to try and have more of you guys to fill out my roster a little bit more. You're cheaper than my Legionnaires. I can't just have just Legionnaires. I need to make sure I have a little bit of you guys so I have something, somebody against cavalry. So, I'll try and leave most of the Coastal Levies as kind of my garrison units, but I'll have these, these guys come with. So let me get a few more of them. Because I'm hoping I'll be able to leave here soon. And then we can go down and take Cordoba. Which they still only have four guys. I just need to be happy to leave here. And then we can go after that. And now that we're starting to con uh, convert to Christianity, we're going to start Deus Voltine a little bit more. Um, let's see, wait, how tall are you? I'm 6'7 and you used to play pro basketball in North Macedonia. Uh, I'm 6'3". Um, so for at least around here, I'm fairly tall, um, but I've never, like, uh, we actually have, uh, one friend between me and Will that, uh, it's mainly more of Will's friend, but, uh, Jake, he's 6'10". He makes me feel small. Let's see, I think someone in a year above that we knew was, like, over two meters, and someone in college must have been 7'6", at least. Jesus. I can't, I, I've never known anybody over seven feet. Jake is the closest because he's at 6'10", he has to crouch everywhere, he's one of the few people I have to like look up at to see. Eastern Roman rebels, people fight, oh Ostrogoths, you guys are, did you lose all your land? Oh shit. Yeah, oh shit, okay. Oh the fucking Vandals. Oh, you motherfuckers. Of course you're following me to hit this area. Fuck. Okay, how are you guys if I leave? Two of them. Very pissy. Uh, I'm already on yearly tax rate. Low. I just need to leave a few of you here. Okay, that's good enough. Can I get any mercenaries around here? Yes, I can. I'm going to grab some, I think. Mercenary Equites, Morris. Grab you two at least. 
Right, let's push down south. We need to get down to Gordova. <laughs> what is that even? Ah, oh, it doesn't give me the odds. It doesn't actually give me the number. Let's see. Uh, fruit punch samurai. Are you the tallest person? I would kind of expect fruit punch samurai to be the tallest person he knows. Just I don't know. Then I like. I don't know how tall, uh, on average, people are over there. I know, at least in if you go to Scandinavia, they are. Hmm, ten viewers. Now seems like a good time to chuck an ad for our Minecraft server. Yes, if anybody's interested, we do have a Minecraft server that we uh, we have set up that uh, we can uh, for my Discord community. Don't forget to check that out. There's a link in my my Discord for that. Honestly, uh, Damien, you just need to remind me more often to randomly plug it, and I'll actually remember to. Because otherwise, the I wish to get so to. The so and so in our favor that I cannot describe them all and still have time for a battle today. <laughs> Over there, the rebel slaves stand to threaten us all. Should they win, at best we will all die beneath their cruel whips. It turns my stomach just to gaze. Is further north at all you are? The they have been brought days. to the battlefield yeah. by mewling infants I'll do instead that of now. leaders. Yeah, if you just I remind me, Damien, more than likely I'll do that. And even now they must be praying to their false gods for mercy. They will have little enough of it from me. Now, you know my reputation and skills, and I tell you, a wall has yet to be made that can keep my army out. Every 60 minutes and at the start and end of each stream. <laughs> Okay, that might be a little bit much, but <laughs> yes, we do need to try and promote it more. Oh, we're not doing a bridge battle, technically. Oh, okay. Well, this is just a bunch of peasants. I should be able to just kill it with my cavalry. I honestly shouldn't need to worry about everybody else. So, I'll just focus on this with my cav units, because they're way the fuck back here, and it's a peasant. So, everybody else just kind of casually walk up. Archers, too. You guys just kind of casually walk up. I'm surprised there's no real vulgar speeches in Rome 1. Um, I think there are some more vulgar ones. I think if you're the barbarians. I think if you're the barbarians, they're a bit more vulgar. When the tall guy feels small, the average guy feels what does he to feel like? Uh, even tiny. Wait, no, let's... Let's wait until everybody else gets over here, and then all of you guys charge them. So far, I haven't been able to see any of the, like, recruitment stuff yet. Where, like, we recruit other types of units, almost, or just, like, right. different ethnicities. Still kind of curious about that, if it's going to happen. Oh, these guys kind of look like they were recruited in, uh... Like, they almost have more barbarian features, at least, with their mustaches and stuff. Okay, but for the most part, because it's just a bunch of peasants... Bring you guys around and flank them. Did you see our wall we're making in Normark? The big boy stuff. Yeah, no, I saw that. Uh, OP Lucky showed me it. Uh, Brorian say, I'll drink from your skull and make you watch while I breed your wife. You're savage. Man, you guys are gonna have such a poor day. Like. Hi, guys. It's just a bunch of peasants. I almost feel sorry for this, honestly. Charging from multiple angles. <laughs> the gods have They've already broken. Uh, we lost literally nobody. God, that's beautiful. Okay, so now the path should be clear at least to Cordoba. And hopefully Cordoba is not going to have that much in it. Like, it only has those four from what I saw. And hopefully they're not that great of units. Because if we can take Cordoba, I hate that I'm going to have to fight against the Vandals again. I was hoping to build myself up, goddammit, because I was hoping my allies would be able to hold them out. Farmer's Convention. It's harvesting season. Goddammit, Vandals. I hate the Vandals. They're gonna be a pain in my ass. Because I was hoping that we could build ourselves up in Iberia through the, like, just hiding behind our allies. And then eventually... Also, make sure to get Watchtowers. Keeping your way down to Cordoba. Are you in my way too? Yes, you are. We can't do that, we have five units over there now. So yeah, this is the one that's got you guys over there. Uh, please leave me alone. 
Let's see, I'm honestly amazed by how dedicated and hardworking my guys are. Yeah, it'd be nice if my my faction members were like that. They all turn, they all disappear randomly. Uh, an active fleet, yes, I know. And so that, that fleet's just gonna sit there. I wonder what happened to the Ostrogoths. Like, where are they going? Noble master. Can you talk to them? them Trade once. rights and map information. Oh, you're allied to the Huns. Oh God. Uh, it's two turns. I think we can accept that. Thing. So I just want to see what land you guys have. I will and then bring this guy down here and we'll try and talk to the Romans as well. I think we're the most active fact, to be honest. You have to tell them to do stuff. True. True. And I was trying to tell them to do stuff before, and then that's what uh, caused the war over the uh, fort. At the Barbarian Empire's peasants are ja and ja are javelin, and you can recruit mercenaries and barracks, stables, and ranges, as well as auxiliary types for non-Roman factions such as barbarians and horse archers. Huh. Hey, oh, kill the turtle plays. How's it going, man? It's been a while since you've been joining in on stream. General. Let's see. Uh, I can just walk past you guys. Engage the enemy. Or not. Prepare for battle. Weird. Uh, let's see. So, oh, the Berbers are here too. Huh. Okay, so you guys have some peasants, some generic Order. dudes. Okay, well, let's get some siege towers. I'm gonna sit here for a little bit. We'll at least get a couple siege towers. I hate that I can't sap the wall. Are the walls just not that large? Oh no, they are very large. They are epic stone walls. Ew. Ooh, that's gonna be fun. Okay, well, you guys are still building that up. Let's see. What's the conversion doing here? That's oh, at 36 so far. It's doing better. That'll be the first settlement, and as long as we can kind of slowly develop them all. Um, I wonder what other city we'll try and convert next, because I hate that I'm going to have to convert them all slowly. Unless I can actually get, like, straight-up priest, which I can't remember if you can. I don't think that was added until oh, medieval. Yeah, no, still diplomats, and if I go back over... No, I've never given the chance to build that. I can get monks here, but you guys don't do anything. Just let me recruit monks, but monks can't convert, which is sad. Okay. Also, what's the city? Oh, that's got a good garrison. God damn it. Uh, am I gonna have to try and actually offer a goddamn peace to the Vandals? I want them to get their asses kicked. Can I do you got so? no movement. He says screaming from a wall. Uh, I can't do anything here, man. I, I don't have money to build anything around here. I can get a better forge, but that's not going to help me. Honestly, I'm tempted to try and convert you guys. Oh, you don't have any? Wait. Oh. I forgot to build the... the oh my God. Okay. Okay, I see. So I forgot to demolish that. Long a goddamn go. Okay, great. Well, let's start converting you guys over to Christianity. Because I forgot to do that. Lower that, and you're already doing monthly games. Uh, let's hope you guys don't revolt. <laughs> let's hope that doesn't happen. Uh, try and get some more guys, please. We'll try and convert Tara. I'll have you guys try and convert, and then that will be a way to try and spread to other things. Oh, it's already going to be going up, just straight up towards Christianity. Okay, that's good. Just don't revolt, please. Don't revolt. Uh, Rampion, I'd say converting them all together is better because neighboring regions have an effect on religion. Well, the thing is, I don't want to try and have it so that everybody's pissed off at me all at once. Um, I'd rather try and have it so that I at least have the benefit from neighboring regions try and convert other areas, so I want to kind of maybe do this one at a time. Because I could see it happening where I could technically lose every single settlement all at once. So I'm going to try and not do that. See, my Greek culture campaigns are uh, are like build zoo stadium. <laughs> I, w I still hate that for some reason I can't go... I can't become just pagan. I want to stay pagan, but it's just like there's no benefit to being pagan as these guys, which sucks. It really sucks. So, hopefully we'll be a bit better off converting Christianity, and then we can just deus vote everywhere. Because that'll at least be fun. But I, I was trying to be pagan for as long as possible. And so I honestly, let's see, we have one, two, three, four, five. I just want five round uh, siege towers. That's perfect. Just uh, one more turn, then. 
Because I want to be able to have every single infantry unit that I've got go onto the walls. And hopefully they won't die. I might want to grab more mercenaries. Kind of mercenaries, kind of get uh, I need more cap. Which, eh, is not doing so well. Yes, I know about the inactive fleet. Damn it! See, this is why I had to be careful. You guys uh, revolted. That's not what I wanted. So, I'm gonna see if you'll just let me siege these guys out. Just build anything, honestly. Because I can't get anything else. Shit. Okay. Um, if you guys sally out... I'm gonna hope you don't. Please don't. Please don't sally out. Ah, uh, this is not what I wanted. I should have spent more time to build up. Damn it! This is not what we need right now. Oh, they're gonna actually f fight me back. Okay. Okay. Um... Let's hope you don't fail, man. Can I battle? No. They are not by two to one, but they have a lot of skirmishers and peasants. If I run away... Uh, I think this will do well. Oh, God. This is off to a great fucking start. Okay. Okay. Well, let's see how this goes. I should have just converted everybody from the get-go. That might have worked out a little bit better in this campaign if I would have done that. Okay, but I've got decent, decent infantry. What I'm going to do... Uh, drop that. You guys blob up. Run away, and we're gonna blob up. You guys need to just hold against whatever they charge at us. They should tire themselves out to get to us. I thought I didn't do that battle. What are you doing? Okay, if, if they're going to be like this, this actually works out well for us. So, I'm going to walk as far back as I can. We're going to have some nice thick blobs. And we have to wait for them to come to us. Basically, I just have to make sure I kill their generals. As their generals die, I'll be fine here. Who's that unit? Let's see, why is there two rebel troops in the north they'll rob your trade route? Um, well, I haven't been able to kill them off yet. Uh, just because we've been pretty piss poor for the past while. See, this is all their light infantry. I'm gonna wait until you guys get away from the towers, and then I'll charge you. If I had the excess money to build an army to get rid of them, I gladly would, but I haven't been able to at the moment. Come on, guys. They're winded, at least. You guys are tired. Yeah, this is all their skirmishers. I just want you to get away from the, ta the wa towers before I try and charge you with my general. Come on, guys. What's that? That's their warlord. At least they're all winded by the time they're going to get to me. They're all going to be very tired. Are you guys going to do anything? They're probably gathering together before they advance forward. Yes, Imperator. I hope you guys just don't die. If you guys rout, we're fucked. Because I need you guys to hold. I need you guys to kill the general, basically. You got some nice thick lines right now. Should be more resilient to breaking. And then the cavalry, I can actually just easily destroy all their skirmishers. If they're ever going to charge me. They're still not advancing on me. Is the AI not going to advance on me? Okay, are they doing anything? Huh. Oh, here they're doing something. You guys run to the side. Basically, you guys, I need you to charge in, and I'll just deal with all their skirmishers. Because they're very tired. They should break almost instantly. General. General. Go back behind the infantry line for now. 
I need them to charge these guys. Because these slingers are fucking me in melee for some reason. I don't know why, but I thank you. Just trying to charge into their sides. Blast the horn. That's what it's now. I need to go kill you. Ignore the infantry. Let's go back to around to the other side and kill this guy. Because the skirmishers and infantry I don't care about. I care about you guys. Oh, I gotta kill this warlord. Please die. Yeah! That's what I want to see. But in battle, it's beyond belief. Oh, uh, I'm just gonna end the fucking battle. Actually, no, run them down. Yeah, run them all down. Run them all down. Run every single one down, please. Oh, the tower's gonna shoot us a little bit. Yeah, that's good enough. That's good enough. Don't want to lose too many guys. Okay. Now, I'm trying to remember if they'll come back. They probably should. They don't want to take too much damage from the towers. There we go. Now, what are you guys going to do? Are you going to come back to fight us? Oh, yes, you're going to try to. You're going to just run back and forth. Oh, God. Okay. How many of you guys have you lost so far? You lost about half your army. Okay, that's good. Running down rebels in a sally. Well, of course. What else am I supposed to do? Because I think if I remember correctly, uh, in Rome, in Rome one, it actually has it so that if you win, if if they just withdraw from a sally, they actually go back into the city. Unlike in medieval two, where they just die. So I need to make sure I still do as much damage as possible. Otherwise. They're just going to freely go back inside and wait, technically, I think is what usually happens. And at this point, at least, I at least took out half their army, and then I'm just going to kind of see if any more will come out and I can run down any more. But I should be fine to kind of just siege my city back, take it back. Probably going to exterminate, like, you dastardly rebels, get a bit of money from that. And then we can actually kind of build ourselves up a little bit more here, properly convert this area, and then we'll slowly start trying to convert everybody else up here. That's what I think we're going to try and do. Just waiting for you guys. are going to just gather together again. Okay, just waste the battle timer. That's fine by me. I wish there was a fa even a faster setting than what I'm currently on right now. For times like this, at least. For just sitting here. Because I think you guys will try and sally out again. Or not? You're just sitting there. Exhausted. Oh, come on, guys. Actually, fight me. You're not just gonna sit there? Okay, yeah. We'll just wait back here. See if they'll come, up, come back. Uh, I just came up with an OP as fuck wall design for Minecraft. Oh, do, sh do share. Do share, Damien. I'm curious. Why are you guys flashing? Yes. Oh, that's weird. Okay. Also, one dislike. Who the fuck did that? <laughs> I was kind of wondering that myself. Maybe it's because I was late. Maybe it's because I was late. I'm not sure. Or maybe it's the fact that I'm having to convert from paganism now and we don't get to be pagan anymore. I don't know. Technically, it's all the same. It uh, it helps the algorithm. It feeds into the algorithm whether or not someone likes or dislikes. So it doesn't bother me too much. Still try and make sure content is enjoyable, but yeah, I'm just curious. Are you guys gonna sell out? No, I think they're just gonna sit there for the last remaining minutes. That way, we'll at least be able to win. Well, because I'm pretty sure they're just going to go back into the city. I just have to... It's been a while since I played Rome. I'm fairly certain that's how the sally out works. As I at least took out half the army. I did that. I'm probably just going to siege it out the rest of the time. Unless they'll just automatically easily just let me uh, auto-resolve it at this point. But I'm hoping you guys, like, try one more sally out against me. Please? If you guys do at least one more sally, I'll feel really good. Because then I can try and kill more of you. Oh, are they? 
I think they're going to. They are bringing more dudes out. Ah, I think they were waiting for the guys to replenish a little bit. At least on, uh... Yeah, they're not as exhausted anymore. So they're gonna try one more attack. Come on, guys. Give me all you got, you barbarian peasants. I love that it makes the distinction. <laughs> that they're specifically barbarian peasants instead of just peasants. Okay, so they are going to attack us one more time. Yep, here they come. Yeah, you guys just kind of go back behind them again. Because again, all we care about is the general. If the general's dead, we easily can just break them all. There we go. Come on, kill him. Oh, are they going to actually get throw shit at this this time? Yes, they are. Okay. Make sure they don't get to. Blast that one. And then you guys get up here and help out against the warlord. Come on, balanced. Where are you guys primarily at? They're mainly on the right side. You guys try and run over here a little bit. Oh, now fight him. Oh, now he's trying to run away. Okay, go up against the slingers then. After the slingers. I need to slow this down, otherwise I'm gonna just get our guys killed. Where's the warlord? Slingers. Warlord. There we go. Okay, that's much better. So we lost a little bit more of our men, but we were able to kill far more of theirs. Okay, let's try and run down a little bit more, if we can. Hold on, be careful, we're a little close to the walls. Pull back, guys. Alright, that should be good. I'll just have to wait the remaining time limit, and then we should have the cities. There. Yeah, we lost almost 200 guys, or a little bit over 200 guys. They lost 1,000. I'm okay with this. Okay, just another two minutes. Are you guys gonna try and attack one more time? Yes, you are. Please don't. I'm done with you guys. I've played with my food enough. Now just roll over and die. Give me back my city. 40, 30, 20. Is the battle not over? What the hell? Okay, I'm just gonna exit. Exit battle. There we go. Okay. Demands victory from her generals, and this day is clearly God our damn victory. my cavalry. Good job, guys, though. Okay, so there we go. <laughs> they should only have 200 guys left, or I'm hoping they'll just all die, and then we can just take my city back. Then we can just make sure... I'm probably going to exterminate it for the money and also just to build it up a little bit more from there. Let's see. And glory. Settlement captured. Let's see. I don't want to disperse the population. I'm just going to exterminate it, honestly. Get that money back. And then that way... Yeah, because it actually doesn't really de demolish much stuff. No, it doesn't. Okay. Perfect. We just get money. Okay, so let's just keep building it up to convert it. You guys are now at least... Over 50% Christianity. Uh, Ram, check DMs and don't leak my design. I can make no promises. Let's see. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Okay, but yeah, no. You guys, we can at least now kind of build this area up. Thankfully, that's now a little bit more money that we'll use to build up my own areas. I forgot how much it helps just to do that occasionally, to exterminate your own populace in Rome 1. Because it doesn't demolish any of my buildings. I can still recruit the same stuff. Uh, like, it doesn't do anything except for just lower the population and makes it so I can easily just like, oh, okay, hey, we got a little bit more money. 
I, I'm now gonna get some stuff here. Like, let's get the port here. Doesn't do anything. Okay. Um, also, what are these units? Slingers and oh. Okay. Let me just do this. Let me get um, a cab unit. I'll get a cab unit with this guy, and then uh, you two can easily finish them off because it's one slinger and one peasant and one spearman. As least as as long as I have at least two guys, I'll be able to easily take that out. Um, let's see, you guys. Again, I kind of want to start converting everybody. Uh, let me get other things for public order first. So, like, let's get this. And then Londinium. Also get that for our law. And then how are you guys doing down here? Imperator. You've got everything built up now. Settlement under siege, sir. Uh, do I want to assault right now? What are the chances? Let's wait a little bit more. Ooh, coming of age! Okay, I'm gonna actually bring you, have you be the governor of, um, Urbiscum, Urbiscum, or whatever. I'm gonna have you be the governor of that area. Family tragedy, oh no! And then resistance is done, yes. Honestly, I should probably just instill more revolts to happen so I can exterminate my populace more. I really should try and honestly do that. It'd help out a lot, a lot. Like, way more than it really should. Um, let's see, you guys... I can't get anything more. I'm just losing money right now. I'm losing 400. I'm hoping that you guys will be happier soon so I don't have to have the taxes like this. Oh, you actually... Oh, not that bad, actually. Okay, well, we're still losing 400 per turn. But no, let's take you and you and let's start getting rid of these guys. So we'll get rid of them, and then we can easily try and make sure that we uh, aren't losing trade because of this. Hopefully they'll stay away. And then, I'm going to assault Cordoba now. I just want to at least wait one more turn and try and start them out a little bit more. Now, lads. Once okay, the for a moment my over, brain thought please. all of this was water. No skipping with the entrails this time. No skipping with the entrails this time? Wait, what? Okay, that was short and sweet. Well, they've got slingers, so... Where are they? I physically can't see them. Oh, there they are. Okay, they're just a bunch of slingers. So just charge them! Hi, guys. Uh, you should be throwing stones at us. Or you can hold your sling like a gun. Sure, that works. Oh, they're trying to run. They are trying. Oh, the general's dead first. The enemy general is killed. Just finish running them down. I want more experience for you guys, too. Don't let any of them get away. There we go. And then, do I have enough uh, movement to get to the other guy? I'm mean, gonna hope I do. Because I'm gonna hope that I can maybe take out that other rebel as well. And then maybe... Th I don't know how much devastation they're causing right now. Hopefully it's not too much, but enough that this will actually be beneficial to take these guys out right now. Ah, uh, uh, you don't have enough time to, movement to get there. Like, how much devastation is there? Oh, devastation 45. Okay, it's noticeable. People in flight, the Sarmatians again? God damn it. Also, honestly, uh, who wants me to just turn Fog of War off? Does anybody want me to do that at this point? Just so that we can actually kind of see what the world's like in general? Usually I like to keep it on uh, for now because it's more interesting to try and see how things are developing without that uh, additional information. And then just kind of see like, oh, that's what's going on over there, or this, or that, or that. Sure. So let's see, you guys. Isn't there a Roman without, settlement up here? Without, I thought there was. Please. Oh wait. I think Eastern Rome is all the way over here. Huh. Okay. Let's see, uh, I play with Bug War off, to be honest. Yeah, because I know for myself, I usually like having it on initially, because it does kind of make it more interesting to explore regions. But later on, I eventually kind of turn it off, because just when the map is so large and we're kind of expanding into more areas, it's more interesting to have it on. Oh, to have it off, sorry. You guys, I can actually increase the taxes here. Yeah, 200. Helps me a little bit more. Uh, oh, I can almost get away with that. No. 
but we can do this. You'll be able to get rid of that guy next turn. I'm going to turn it off. So let's turn Fog of War off. We'll keep it off for now. And wow, okay, that's interesting to see what the world looks like. The Vandals. Oh, you guys are kicking the Vandals' asses. Good, because fuck the Vandals. Vandals are doing some stuff over there. It looks like the Western Roman Empire is burning over here in Carthago Nova. I do find it interesting that, like, right now, the Western Roman Empire kind of controls, like, what uh, the Holy Roman Empire controlled. This is just rebel here. Eastern Rome is actually doing very well. Besides the fact they lost Constantinople, they're doing very well over here. Like, they've actually control continued to hold all this stuff over here. Huh. Okay. Okay, okay. Wait, no. let us assault this area. Let's take Cordoba for ourselves. Because I'm hoping I can take the other land that they've got, uh, Carthago Nova. And then I can build myself up and then kind of pincer the Vandals. Because I want to finish them off. But it's going to be difficult to kind of make sure we take all this land with um, the Ostrogoths and the Burgundies over there as well. Like, they're definitely going to cause us some issues. Now, hopefully these walls aren't too epic. Hello, Lichenhammer. How's it going, man? Because these, uh, these walls are epic enough that I can't sap them, which sucks. You're oh, probably cool. wondering why I've called you here today. I was wondering myself. <laughs> oh, yes. The city's people look to us to save them. If we are to keep them from slavery, rape, and slaughter, then we must hold firm. There Dude, we're no assaulting. Slaughter, no weakness. If needs be, this is where we die. But it will not come to that. We shall fight like true warriors and prevail. Dude, we're the ones assaulting. Think their walls are enough to okay, stop now us. you're attacking for think a second. Again. Our numbers are vastly superior. It may not seem fair. But we are not here to be fair. Why don't think this guy win. drank before he gave this speech? Many times I have faced this enemy, and many times I have beaten them. Today, when we win, this victory will be yours as much as mine. This morning we took the auspices. I'm honestly just gonna like seldom if been so cannon clear. for me. My dude's just drunk. This is most drunk. wonderful. A triumphant outcome to our battle is guaranteed. Oh, don't, don't, now, don't be so certain you know too just yet, man. We might and fail. Skills, and I tell you. A wall has yet to be made that can keep my army out. Okay, let's get going. And these are some big ass walls. Okay, so skirmishers. You're gonna group up at least. And so I'm gonna put one here, because I think I can put you here. 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 And I'll try and have one go here. That should do. The ferryman will be busy today. The enemy have brought more men to the fight. Man, these are some tall ass walls. Damn. Uh, like, I like the alternate uh, universe where Romana British reconquered the entire West. <laughs> like, honestly, that's where we're kind of approaching. Let's see, I think so as well. Original Barbarian Invasion only had a simplified version of the general speeches in vanilla. And see a separate mission. Oh, damn it! You're already burning one. You guys pull back for now. You guys don't run over here. Run away from the walls. Yeah, let that one burn. So far, all the other ones are getting into the walls. Oh, can you give us a good close-up of the enemy troops? Yes, I can. It's like, here are some. Oh. Here we go. Here's some of the other units they got. These guys have a nice armor piece. I like that. Let's see, these guys are that same unit. Um, let's see, this is some of their peasants. Yes, the glorious peasants. This is a step on the path to victory. The towers are at the walls. There we go. And I think I'll have it so you'll go over here. Have them out there. From the war, Romans have generic baldness for reasons. They're camera shy. <laughs> You guys should be able to easily get a stake up here because they don't have many guys trying to defend here. This is 
a step on the path to victory. They do have a lot of guys over the here. The towers are at the walls. Okay, guys, get up on the walls. And again, yeah, you guys kind of come over this way. I might actually have my skirmishers go over here too. Casually walk, because if I can get you guys kind of over here and have you shoot into them or down into the ground, uh, that should actually work out really well for us. So wait for you guys to get up the towers. I hate that I can't see them in there. I can't follow them. Wait, where's the ladder? <laughs> what? Ah, I see. You guys aren't there yet. Come over here and help out. I'll use your skirmisher if you need to. Uh, this guy's getting his ass kicked. You guys go about. You do. Get up on the walls. Do the, uh, do the narration sounds like their voice cracks every so often? Ah, uh, I think so. I'd have to pay attention next time. There we go. So you guys are doing well over here, at least. The other side's not doing so well. God, I still love just being able to yeet people off the walls. Okay, so you guys can easily kill them there. Uh, these guys are... Okay, there you go. You got some reinforcements now. I love how every single official settlement is the capital except for, uh, this. Yeah, no, we actually have a lot of capitals kind of right now on our Minecraft server. Ooh. Yeah! I like you guys are remembering that you actually have your fucking Jones. <laughs> you guys have almost broken, because then once you guys can push through here to this unit, this one lays you right closely surround him. You guys are doing okay there. Um, archers, I want to try and bring you guys in here. I want to see if you guys will actually be able to shoot them from over here. You might be able to. Eh, okay, just try that. Uh, just, yeah, the English, Roman, uh, light units and battlefield announcer have the same voice range. Okay, but yeah, no, you guys go up here. Are you almost done with this unit? Almost. They're wavering. 32 guys. Come on, you're almost done. Oh, what is going on here? Oh, no, okay, for a moment I thought they were glitchy. Come on, break. I don't like how things are going over here. I really don't like that. Come on. There you go. Fighting to the death. Stop that. Okay, get over here. We need to kill this unit now. Because after that, what do they got? Great gods! Our soldiers have done well this day. The walls are taken! Ah, perfect. So, cavalry, uh, go fuck up these peasants. Because these are just all peasants down here. I'm not worried about them. Infantry, you guys just all focus on this unit here. Come on, surround it. It's the only way you're going to actually be able to kill them. So we have five capitals, only three of which have walls. We have fire the printer. We have two handed sword units, two hundred two men. Ooh. I love how we kicked more of the guys off the walls than actually did anything. Oh, those peasants are already dead. Oh, that was fast. Okay, so now I'm gonna have it so uh, you're breaking. Let's see the way we're gonna get to the city center. I just want to make sure that we actually have the towers under our control. Um, you guys kind of go this way. You guys casually walk up this way. Just casually walk. Archers as well. Because this will be the way that we're going to go, and then I just need to make sure that these towers are under my control, otherwise they're just going to shoot us while we do that. Okay, and then you're still breaking. Okay, well, Gav, I'll have you guys also slowly advance up this way. Let's speed up this now. Because I think they just have peasants left, right? Uh, peasants. Peasants. And general. Okay, so they do have a cab unit. They do have them. Um, and actually, they've got one more of their heavy infantry units. Well, hopefully they'll let me actually slowly advance up and I can just shoot them. Because if I can get you guys... To about here. I think you guys can shoot me. Because 
Basically, I want you guys to go here, casually walk, and in general as well, kind of casually walk over here so you're nearby and giving the inspiration. There we go. Everybody just move over to those positions. God, this take you guys forever to walk over this way. Um, let's see. In 170 AD, there was so much food. Romans could eat large varieties of food for three hours. The period this game takes place, Romans could afford one loaf of bread a day. Huh. Things drastically changed in that time, then. Yeah, you guys just keep monitoring. Oh, what are you doing? Barbarian cavalry. You're kind of stuck. Kind of back up a little bit, please. That's not exactly how I was hoping you guys would do that, but you go over here instead. I'm gonna adjust you myself, because otherwise you guys are idiots. No, literally, that's the only way you can fit in this area. Okay. Okay, well, infantry are almost all here. Skirmishers as well. Come on, guys. And then we'll shoot the general, possibly. Uh, what would your ideal bodyguard soldiers mind to be cataphract horse archers? Uh, honestly, cataphract horse archers would probably be the thing, too, for me. As long as they can also have a pretty good melee attack. That's what I'd probably prefer. Let's kind of slow it down. You guys, I'm going to start kind of moving forward a little bit. Kind of move up this way. Cavalry kind of follow them. And I'm going to hope... Can you guys hit them from here? No, you can't hit them from here. Damn it. Okay, so we'll have to move up a little bit more. So it's going to go right here. And just casually walk. We don't want you guys to tire yourself out too much. Cav, I'm gonna have you guys go over to the side. Because if you guys go there, we can actually fly. Infantry, I just need you to actually hold. Oh, that's not what I wanted you to do. Run up here, guys. Don't break, damn you. I'll have you guys get in there. Archers start opening up on their good units, and my guys are breaking. Damn it, that's not what I wanted. Please don't tell me I'm gonna lose this. Taxes went up 300% in 400 Odin? Oh, Jesus. Back up, guys. I'm just trying to get rid of their cow. Come on. Archers. Focus on my cap, please. We'll rally them. Oh, this is gonna be fucking close. I need to kill the general. Come on, archers. Keep shooting them. General, please just don't die. You guys need to back out of there. I need you primarily to focus on the general. But she's dying. Pull you guys out for a second. Infantry, get back over here. Yeah, archers, just keep doing your thing. Archers, you're doing amazing the enemy general is running away. There you go, this guys. No I just to make sure my archers just don't break. Which they might. Ah, damn it. Right, hold that position. Infantry. Come on, kill. This thing gets getting in the way. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, please. Uh, let's get you guys out of there. The enemy general is running away. There we go. Yeah. Please tell me it's all of them. gods be praised. The enemy general is killed. Okay. Archers now just really shoot people. Hearts. Uh, you have three archers. You should bait them, not fight them where they have infra morale. Enjoy the stream. 
I've been trying to bait them out of here, but they just don't want to leave the city center. That's the issue. If they don't want to leave the city center. They just want to stay around in here. So I'd love to be able to bait them out of the city center, but they just want to ignore that. Infantry. How is this guy want still alive? Oh, I did not. Damn it! I meant to turn on guard position. Pulling away. They're kind of following my cow. There we go. Now, archers, please move forward. Let's see. And then when the Romans settled in, the Romans treated them horribly, but then when the we can then be kind of fun. Okay, yeah, keep running around. Just keep distracting these guys for now so my infantry can do stuff. Actually, okay, walk back up here, please. You guys walk forward. Because I don't think you guys will follow me outside the city center if I leave this area. I don't believe so. I'll try to. Let's see if you guys will follow. Because usually they just kind of get to the edge and then stop chasing me. War is hell, but this is some bullshit. <laughs> Pretty much, honestly. Yeah, no, they just don't want to leave the city center. No matter what I do, they just don't want to follow. So I'm trying to get you guys into a position where you can just unload on them. So got 12 minutes left. I got one of my infantry units who's trying to casually walk forward. Careful there. Yeah, I'll come back around now, now that they've got their backs turned to us. Because I can charge him in the back with my cow. Okay, pull away. This unit you're not going to be able to do anything about, so just run away. Run away, please. Okay. This guy's not at least. Great God! Oh, now I killed the general. I thought I already killed him. The enemy general is killed. Okay, Cav, get over here. Now, enemies' hearts. Will you guys actually follow me out of the city center? If you actually do, that'd be great. Nope, then they gave up immediately. Okay, archers, turn around and just shoot them. Okay, get that charge in, and then we'll pull back. Gustavus Adolphus picked up those swords. You're trained for this. Archers, just keep firing on him in the back. There you go. Pull back again. So the archers get as many shots as they can. And I'll just move like one of you up at a time. It's gonna have you guys staggered. There, there, and there. Don't, don't run. Guys, get out of the city center. We've got ten more minutes that I can keep just dicking about with them. Maybe I just walk. Okay, back around again. Hopefully this is the last time I have to do this. We've got 80 guys left. Again. Archers do your thing. You guys move up just a little bit. Because you have javelins. Now get back here, fight me. Cool. Not have enough guys in the city center to capture it yet. Oh, that's why. Because you guys are not all in the city center. There. And then you, right here. There we go. 
Shouldn't need my cat now at this point. Because as soon as you guys either kill them all or... There's... There we go. Shoot them from three different angles. There we go, finally. Victory! By the decree of fate, perhaps. But victory I joined and at first thought you were in a battle in the parking lot. You can tell I'm saying. Parking lot fight circa 1730s, uh, 376. <laughs> Sounds about right. Pretty much. The Battle of Cordoba car uh, parking lot. There we go. That's at least another city for us in Iberia now. Let's see. How's it going? How much money is court going to make us? Victory and glory! Settlement capture! Let's see. I need all that money. Thank you for all that money. Okay, so let me... Uh, repair everything. Ooh, there's a mine here. First and foremost, I need to retrain my dudes. First do that. Uh, we're gonna have to try and convert this place at some point. It's... See, religious buildings is the main thing. I'll demolish that in a second. I need to make sure my army is built up beforehand first. Honestly, which one are we gonna be making? I wonder. Yeah, no. Just repair that stuff, and I think for now, at least, just build up... Do we have the... We don't have a Coliseum yet. Weird. Okay, get that. Build that up first, and then we can actually try and do stuff. So, is there anything else I can build right now? Nope, everybody is building something. Yes, I know this fleet is inactive. I might be able to retrain it soon. I might have enough money for that now. Hi, Ostrogoths. How's it going, guys? You're still alive somehow. Hopefully you'll still continue being my faithful allies. I'm going to hope that's going to be the case, because I really need you. Um, let's see. Keep retraining. How much money are we making now? Ah, we're now making 2000 Okay. Keep retraining dudes, and then I'm going to get some more... Wow, you guys actually can get some nice archers here. Ooh, they've got a lot of experience. Okay, so until this is done, I'm just going to keep recruiting some guys. So you guys, let's get... Uh, that helps with public order. Honestly, might not, might as well. Just grab that. Because you guys are still converting, and eventually you'll start helping out against neighboring regions. It's 46 pay, uh, Christianity... 5%. Okay, so you're getting 5% from this. Okay, perfect. Come on, keep kicking the vandals' asses, please. You guys can't build anything. Okay, Tara, though, you can keep getting this upgraded, because we need to continue converting you guys, which at the moment you're getting 25%. You're getting 15% from characters, which is good, so this is slow. Oh, wow, that's actually a hell of a lot faster, honestly. Uh, inactive fleet. Yes, I know. I could maybe. Victory! Oh, they just. Okay, they just slaughtered them. Do you have a temple or building that lets you recruit units with experience bonuses and retrain them? Do that. Do they get the XP? Uh, I believe so. I believe if you have that, because I think that's what's going on right down here, honestly. Because um, these archers didn't have as much experience when I first got here. But the archers I can recruit right now do. And actually, yes, because this guy right here had no experience, and he just went up to two of them. Get another warlord. Is this like a straight-up general? Or is this just... I'm curious. I'm going to try and recruit it. Although, actually, I want to get other guys. I'm, I need more legionaries. Because I'm curious if that would actually be a uh, new general. Let me get rid of these mercenaries. There we go. Get rid of those guys. <laughs> Ramon needs for time for another hand. We're 15 viewers. Who good. <laughs> Why, yes, Damien. Thank you for reminding me. <laughs> that, yes, for anybody that's interested in my... If you don't already know, on my uh, Discord server, we have a Minecraft server. So you can check that out if you're interested. <laughs> Damien's helping, uh, helping remind me to advertise it every once in a while. Let's see, you guys, yeah, just keep recruiting a little bit more, and then I think... Yeah, at that point, let's try and start converting you guys here. Because I need to make sure that I do... Yeah. You also are giving 10% from characters as well, so hopefully that'll help. Uh, you guys are putting that up. 
We'll soon be able to get the monks. You can't get anything, can't get anything, can't get anything, can't get anything. People in flight, the Roxolani. Oh, wow! What happened to them? Oh, they got their asses kicked too. Okay, well, looks like then the Franks are doing very well for themselves over here. I know Charles will be happy about that. I find it fascinating how the world has developed so far. So right now we've got a massive empire with the Huns. Got a mat like the East Roman Empire is doing very well for themselves. They've barely lost anything over here. The Sassanids have doing been doing really well up here. Western Rome is still holding the center of their empire. They've lost France. And I'm hoping that I can kind of conquer Cordoba for not Cordoba, I uh, Iberia from them. And then just reclaim France. At the probably general and barbarian empires, you can get the Marine general at the Imperial Plastic City turns. I'll start reminding you till the end now. <laughs> a year and a half. Um, yeah, because I know for, I know like in medieval, obviously, you could just recruit generals. I can't remember if they allowed you to do that in Rome. I just can't remember. Let's see. Okay, you guys know what's going on there. I'll just keep gathering together some money inactively. I know! I think I maybe we can retrain them now. I'm making enough money I can do so. And we'll try and build that army up so that I actually have a proper navy. Could go into detail about the Minecraft server more. Right? I already did one though. This is the second one, Char. Oh, uh, oh, Flash Love. We need to sponsor him every video so he gives it a full two minutes. <laughs> like I, I, I give the most detailed description in the beginning, but I don't want to detract and talk only about that for like the next two minutes. Okay, let's see, you guys here. Okay, now let's try. This is gonna piss you guys off. So, demolish that. Yes. You're pissy. What can I do about public order, at least? I can lower the taxes. Corruption, 1,200. Holy shit. Do that. We're going to lose a bit of money for now, but you guys are happy enough that we can get away with this, so build that up. I might be able to at least actually have normal taxes. Yeah, I can have normal taxes, so we're not losing a ton here. We need to start converting you guys now. Let's see, I think Man of the Hour instead of Critical Generals. It might be like that. Uh, what's your opinion on cauliflower cheese? I don't think I've had it. I don't think so. I don't believe so. I'm not sure. Um, I know there's like cauliflower rice and I've tried that and that's okay. Uh, but I don't know about cauliflower cheese. I have no idea about any of that. Western Roman Rebels are popping back up. Okay. Western is anybody ever going to get a foothold and keep it? Like, are any of these barbarians ever going to survive? Because it feels like that's not the case right now. I think that's one of the reasons why I don't like barbarian invasion as much as uh, vanilla. Because these empires never die. Uh, what's your opinion on KFC? Wait, what? Is that an actual thing, Damien? I don't think it's an actual thing. But I'm curious if it actually is. Okay, keep eating this chapel. Oh good, you guys actually took some land around here. Ah, oh, we've got plague here! Yay! That's fucking wonderful. Okay, well you guys here. Um... I want you to grab... I'll get the better walls right now, because that does help with the core. Same here, just upgrade the walls. Uh, you guys... Did you lose your train? Oh, I forgot to bring it back yet. That's why. There we go. Now you guys are happy. Now, get the walls. You guys get the better church. Cauliflower cheese is boiled cauliflower covered in a cheese sauce and then grated cheese on top of it. Personally, I like broccoli mixed in. Oh, that doesn't sound too bad, actually. It's an actual thing. I'm not kidding. Well, it might be a thing over where Damien lives. Let's see, uh, this much, uh, and this settlement west of it had plague for 10 years straight. Oh, God. Then again, that's actually pretty realistic, honestly. More Sammy members? Good! We're actually having some. A lot of games held. Ah, uh, yay. Death stocks the land. Lost 2,000 citizens so far in Londinium. And you guys have a new home land. I still need to conquer that piece of land. Because how long until I can get you guys out of here? I wonder. 
Because I've got three legionnaires if I get this guy. I'm gonna recruit a few more. Um, give me another one of these guys. Basically, I'll just try and recruit some guys, bring them down here, and I'll have it so that I just retrain them in Cordoba. Because Cordoba's got a really good retrain. Oh yeah, I forgot to talk to the Eastern Robbers with you. Go to Sinop. I will address them at once. Ah, you're so good. Uh, it's like the driest, most crunchy piece of bread and oldest piece of meat I've ever tried. Somehow the bread has more flavor than the meat. Huh. That's ancient history. Do you want a plague? They say no. It's an evidence bit. Plague in London, 430? It's not so different from 2021 after all. <laughs> Ah, we're just reliving history a couple centuries beforehand. Let's see. I'll ask for trade and map information from you guys. Uh, that's not bad. Our thanks. Okay, and then how much money am I making right now? Uh, I'm losing about 1600 Why? Do they block any one of my ports? Or it might just be the guys that are recruited. Well, these guys are dying. It's probably got a definite effect on it. I don't know if you guys raise your taxes. You guys can also raise your taxes. You guys are fine as you are, and you guys can raise your taxes. Oh, you already actually have high taxes. Oh, perfect. Raise them again. So let's see. I think... Let's grab you. I'm going to be moving on to Carthago Nova soon. So bring you guys down this way. Oh, hi there. Uh, withdraw. I'm gonna have you just fight them just now. Sounds like White Castle to me, Damien. I actually like White Castle, though. White Castle's actually pretty decent. Or at least I think it is. Ah, uh, Damien sounds like having blind chicken and tofu for tasting the tofu. Oh, excuse me. Let's see. Desert Land. Flash Flood. Okay, not an area I care about. And another family tree. Oh, no! I might actually get rid of a little bit of less of my, or a few of my guys. Because right now, uh, let me get some money. I have a barely enough over here. I'll, I'll try and see what I'll just like next turn. I can actually get rid of this navy. I'm actually going to try and bring you guys up here. See if you'll survive. And if you can, then I'm going to have you move that one in general. That to try and move. Oh, you're fine guys. You did your thing. You did your thing. Don't worry. No, it was the same stuff Casey always gives you. Huh. Okay, okay. Ah, uh, no, I'm still losing a little bit of money. Oh, shit. Um. Okay, can you guys leave Cordoba? Ah, uh, no, you're pissed. Lower the taxes. Okay. Uh, you can't get past this guy. I'm just gonna honestly get rid of you. And then you guys just, let's start making our way over to Carthago Nova. Because if I can take that, we'll have practically all of Iberia under our control, besides this one little settlement, and we can kind of just keep pushing up and slowly try and kill, push the vandals back. Let's see, in to war for economy, should it be farming, then trade, and taxes from, like, minor cities onward? What terms when it gives the faction heir to the... Okay, so for, for, for my experience, at least, with Rome, Rome Total War, it's more important to focus on trade than farming stuff. At least for me, because of the fact that you can recruit, like, you have so many guys that uh, you'll get from just, put, like, you grow ridiculously fast in your cities, and I don't think you technically need to focus on growth as much as you do on specifically just trade. You get the most money from trade by far, from my experience at least. Um, let's see, who's the pink faction hiding in France? That would be um, the Burgundy. That would be the Burgundy faction as they have now found a new homeland for themselves. I'm losing... Oh, oh, sorry, Lombardi. That's Lombardi, not Burgundy. Burgundy is the other one, which I don't know where they are either. Uh, they're somewhere. Because there's Roxolani. I find it funny that the, the Huns have one of the most stable empires right now. 
It's fascinating. Ah, oh, here they are. Here's Burgundy. Uh, Ryan, what is your opinion on Barbarian Scum? I wonder if Plus is under attack. He should. Might be Charles the Bold entered the chat. Oh! Ah, uh, Jesus Christ, that's a powerful goddamn navy. Withdraw! Withdraw! Well, I'll make a little bit of money at least. Fleet ready! God, I hate that my navy sucks. Aye, aye, Captain. I'm gonna keep trying to send you over here, because if anything, it will slowly die off and give me more money. But you keep going for Carthago Nova. Portaba. I need to keep building this up. Because we're slowly converting everybody. You guys are at 75% here now. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah, my cities are a hell of a lot happier now that we're Christian. I hate that we had to do that. I want to stay pagan. Let's see. Oh, the Roxolanian Huns are at war again. You guys have a new homeland in France again. I need France, damn it, guys. Well, the Huns were pretty accepting of cultures as long as you knew who all of them. True. This is true. I just kind of find it funny. They've, like, they've conquered and, like, remade their own, like, Greek empire. I kind of find that funny. Because what I'm thinking I'm going to be doing is... Yeah, we'll be probably just keep pushing up north from this point here. Once we, uh, have Carthago Nova under our belt. Then we can try and just kill off the Vandals and hopefully actually kill them off. Oh my god. Actually kill them off. Western Roman Herbal's already dead again. Well, they tried. Imperator. Oh. Prepare okay, that was weird. Um, don't siege. even get the rams. Just go for siege towers. There's lots Stay and lots of siege towers. Siege, Let's see, rebel armies, men, rebel navies, bodybuilder, not steroids and protein. <laughs> Literally. Also, I need to be right back. Um, I need to use the restroom. Enjoy the wonderful music. Okay, now I'm back. Um, let's see, so anyone in chat looking forward to any games being released in the future? Hans are the Aboriginal priest. Aside from this game, none coming to mind, no. Listen to the wonderful music. I wish I could, but my lungs are saying no to that man. Oof. But Rome One Music cures all ails. Rome, Rome One Music is great. Okay, 
Um, am I building everything that I can right now? Oh no, you guys can build some stuff for more here. How much does this pork give me? Uh, nothing. Okay. Um, that'll give me a little bit. Actually, I, can I lower, increase your taxes here a little bit? A little. Uh, let's actually just keep focusing and get the monastery. It focuses on more public order, which we need. <laughs> I'll go to War 1 music cured my virginity. <laughs> Uh, um, let's see. What do the three numbers left of Cordoba mean? Um, left of, like, over here? Uh, because this shows the settlement resistance, so how long it takes to siege it out. This shows the level of the wall, and then this shows how many men are garrisoned currently in the city. Let's see. Uh, if I could hear it over my hacking and wheezing ones. Franks dead yet? Uh, no, the Franks are actually building themselves back up a little bit more over here. They are outliving uh, some of the other factions currently. Am I at war with them? No, I'm just neutral with them. You know, the Franks are still alive. The Vandals are slowly dying, which I love and I'm very happy about. Um, we almost have all of Iberia under our control. Western Roman rebels are dead now again. Those guys are the ceasefire. Oh, the Western Roman Empire and the Huns are now at war. Oh, God. That's going to be interesting. Uh, inactive diplomat... I've now literally talked to everybody. Literally, I've talked to everybody. I have no need for a diplomat ever again. So, I've got pretty much like trade with everybody. Let's so we can just end that turn. Ooh, Salamantica is unhappy. Why are you guys unhappy? Oh, now you're not. Okay, uh... Let's just get another... Well, actually, why do you guys... You are actually cheaper than these guys. I'm actually going to recruit one of the monks as a garrison unit. I'll try and do that. Hey, did you guys really mad that up? Oh, please leave me alone. I need an assassin. I need a good assassin. Because I need to get rid of all these guys. Spy, diplomat, merchant. You can get an assassin here. But my navy keeps dying. Um, you can't. You can't. Yeah, because I'm not getting that. So do you think cataphract camels are practical? Um, I don't know enough about the physiology of a camel to say otherwise. I could see it. Um, no, camels are too slow to be effective shock cavalry. This is true. If, it depends on if you're having them, like, be horse archer cataphracts. But, I don't know, like, I know there have been, haven't there been some armored camel, uh, horse archers? Or, or like, horsemen? Sorry, not horsemen, that makes no sense, this is from camels. Um, mounted units. I could have sworn that I remember seeing, like, some stuff about mount, or armored camels. Maybe not specifically with the cataphract type of armor, but I think it'd be still possible. I just don't know enough about physiology of a camel to say otherwise. Um, okay. Anything else I can get up here? No, you guys don't need to build much up here. I do need to get your walls fully upgraded at some point. You guys at least get the hermitage. Because these guys... You're already on very high tax rate. I love that. Good. Stay like that. Because then I can have it. I already have yearly games. So you're making as much money as you can from here. Yeah, you guys can't too much. Imperator. Our siege equipment done. Now we need one more turn. Settlement one more turn, and then sir. we can ta attack Carthago. Franks and Huns have broken their alliance. Lombardi. So many people just keep going all over the place. So you guys have taken some land over here. Like, what factions are still alive right now? So if we go to diplomatic standing, I want to see living factions. So only a few have died. So the Saxons are dead, Celts are dead, and the Alemanni are dead. Nobody else has died. Which is kind of crazy, actually. Diplomatic, oh my god. I am at war with so many people. Jesus. A lot of people actually do like me. Franks, Huns, Burgundy... Assassinates. I'm not trading with the Ostrogoths somehow, which is weird. I guess it's because they don't actually have land right now, so I can't actually trade with them. But I'm hoping I can maybe get up to this rebel settlement soon. Uh, you don't need to do anything then. 
Oh, random crash, okay. Don't know why it crashed. I think it should work if we just load the game back up once it lets me load the game back up. Uh, yes, send the crash report. This is one of the reasons why I'm so glad we have the wonderful autosave system that we have in this. go let's load this back up because it was just before I ended the turn so we'll load that auto save load game load campaign um, end of turn 141 god we've done 141 turns in this campaign so far I'm to do the, M60. Oh, the ancient way okay now will you let me end the turn I'm hoping it'll let me end the turn. Or am I just hitting a... No, it's working still. Okay. Good. Okay, now we can actually assault Carthago Nova. Let's go save that. And let's also assault here! So you guys have... You do have a general in here. And then a gen bunch of generic... Oh, actually, whoa, wow. First cohort. Ooh. Oh, you got some good units in here. Ooh. This is gonna be interesting. I do a number you four to one. So I even have Charles satisfied here right now. Tries to remove his computer starting the fire. Yeah, don't even joke, Fluff. Like, you will probably jinx my computer. The fuck is that guy's name? Uh. Hannibal Anus the Kind? What? I didn't even pay attention to that. Okay, so as long as I can surround their units, I think we should be fine here. That is a really good unit they've got, though. They've got, like, one of their proper cohorts here, too, it seems like. Let's see, did you guys have the epic walls? Yes. Only a fool cares for omens and portents. No Hannibal, matter how bad they may Hannibal be, anus the we make our own destinies, and we are not ruled by the flight of some damn bird. <laughs> they cower behind their walls and pray for help. Many times I have faced these people, and still they are too stupid to learn their lesson. Today, men will die to teach them afresh that they should simply run away. It'd be some nice if they learned that. Will soon lie dead. The rest will drink to their memory, but, as always, we Romans will fight with honor! Yeah! We're slowly getting to the point where we are going to properly control all of Western Rome. I love that. Um, okay, so let's again have it so... You... I don't want all my legionnaires on this side, so you and you... And you here... Here... Here and actually no, you on this side, you on this side. There we go. But he still did do stupid shit. <laughs> these towers so damn uh, high. Imagine these towers, the tallest building in the world. Like seriously, this is pretty damn tall. Let's see, archers. I'm gonna have you guys group up, be a little closer together. And this guy just kind of wait for one of the walls to get up there. Okay, start the battle and go to the walls. Do they actually have their guys on the walls? Yes, they do. So they've got... Okay, they have one of their good units up there. Everybody else is down in the city center, aren't they? Yeah, they got one guy over there. General there. Are these going to sit in the city center? I'm hoping they will. As the resident Attila player, I can't understand how the battle is so small and the usual for Attila 6k and why you didn't auto-resolve this. Uh... The thing is, though, Damien, the auto-resolve in Rome is very different from modern Total Wars. If there's a sliver of a chance the enemy can win, they actually can. Because, I, I know for myself, um, I was playing as the Sarmatians once, and the Huns came in with their initial stacks. And 
as the Sarmatians with an initial um, one stack army of just a bunch of my generic initial spearmen, I won every single auto resolve against the Huns for the next five turns. I am not joking, that has happened to me on the defense. I had a chance and I slaughtered them. By the end of that, the Huns were not a threat. I had gold experience on every single unit and I fucking wrecked them. The uh, like I know more recently in Attila, like if you have like a 74% chance, you're guaranteed to get that win. In Rome, that is not the case. If if there's a sliver of a chance the enemy can win against you, they actually can. It's not like, oh, you we have 75% of the chance of victory. Oh, we'll take a little more casualties. No, in one of four auto resolves in Rome, they will fucking murder you. Also, it's more fun to just kind of actually fight the battles yourselves. Uh, engine limitations. If only Rome had land and siege battles. Rome auto resolving would be like me saying no to fast food. Have you seen the unique settlements in Romus Directum? Um, it's been a really long time since I played Romus Directum, so I don't believe so. Also, it's more fun if you guys get to just watch me possibly fail. So, it's more, it's more fun to try and auto-resolve this. I would fight the battle myself. Uh, yeah, the higher the difficulty, the less chance you have an auto-resolve. That too. That is an important thing to keep in mind. Also, oh, you guys. Our soldiers have captured the walls! Now is the time to press okay, on. Hey guys, and let's go flank. Yeah. Go surround him. Uh, you're not this yeah. You guys come over this way. Let's see. You guys feel like you're winning here. I don't like this. I can't easily flank you guys. You guys are trying. Oh no, you guys should be able to actually get over here and flank them. These guys are trying to as well. We have the gates open. Just have this one unit hold. Um, where's that other guy? You. Come up this way. Oh, they broke. Come on, up out over here. Let's ignore that guy. You're just stuck there. Okay. Uh, that unit kicked my ass. It is still kicking my ass. Can you stop that? Can you guys please stop? Okay, good. They're actually now winning against. Please. Uh, the Roman Rectum does have the best of, sorry, best loading screens and textures before Rome Two. Um, I can agree to that. I can agree. To that. Okay, now they're all running away. Skirmishers, let's group you guys up. Infantry. I'm gonna wait and see if you guys will maybe come back. Maybe I'm gonna wait for this unit. I'm just gonna keep running back and forth. All of my archers kind of march up. Actually, while we're waiting, um, I want you to take this tower. Kind of casually walk over there, make sure that tower is under my control. And then I think uh, we should be good over here. Because I want to walk up this way. Maybe I'll have you guys kind of go walk over here. Capture this tower for us. There's then skirmishers. Move you forward. And I'll bring the cab in too. Do you find that I find it cool that Carthage invented the Well, I thought it was uh, Rome that did, or did the Romans steal it from Carthage? I wouldn't be surprised if they did, but I could have sworn that I thought it was that uh, Romans developed that, not the Car Carthaginians. Take this tower. Too. Take that tower, and then you guys. That's as far as you should need to go over that way. So you guys can make your way back over here. Like, I don't know what you guys are fighting to the death with. Oh, you're just stuck here. I see. You think that they're still gonna bring men forward. Okay, well, let's have you guys march forward. Walk up to this area. Um, like there should be. Well, yeah, the Romans stole a lot of shit. <laughs> they stole so many things. But no, uh, let's have you guys kind of casually start walking up this way. Oh. Um, let's have you not go that way. If you go that way, you're gonna... Actually, who's trying to go that way? 
No, don't go that way. You're gonna get shot at. This tower is not under our control. So just casually walk over around this way. There we go, guys. Archers, let's have you march up this way. You guys, please just slowly make your way up here. As long as we've got enough time, you guys should be able to easily take them out. Also, you guys have it so that it increases your missile attack, too. Oh my god, it does. I love that you guys get increased missile attack, because I don't remember it doing that in Rome 1, did it? No, 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 wait. Yes, no, it, it was Medieval that they changed that. So Medieval doesn't increase your weapon attack and stuff like that with it veterancy. Rome 1 does, and that's what I find hilarious about Rome 1. It's so broken, as so. hell. You guys rush over here so you can kind of provide support. Again, you guys are going to casually walk up here. Just walk. And archers, I'm going to have you guys kind of stagger. Oh, you go back there. You go there. And then you go right there. And I'll kind of stagger you guys forward, kind of move you up, so that you can slowly start shooting everybody in the city center. Stand behind them. So I want you guys to just hold this position. And then my archers can open fire on them. At least some of them. I'm going to move you guys up a little bit. And okay, you guys move up. Also, you guys should have some Right there. Hold them at bay! So you guys kind of go flank around, please. Trying to flank this unit. Let's fight them. You guys do come over this way. The general bodyguard can't be completely impervious, even if I surround him with spearmen. There we go. Some of their guys are breaking the fucking walls. Get in cap. Let's run you over this way. I feel like they're losing. I like that. Cav, kind of like right here. Because then I can have you guys charge into this unit. I love how Conan is the one that's been making us win this war in uh, Iberia. It's only thanks to the efforts of Conan. Oh man, this is their elite unit, isn't it? Yeah, no, this is their first, first cohort. Co sorry, first cohort. number on me. Holy shit. Okay, let's back up and get another charge. These guys are slowly dying, but not fast enough. And this first cohort is weak as hell. Can I get first cohorts? I want first cohorts. First cohorts. Uh, my infantry's dying. Yeah. Uh, so I had to go take care of my cat, what I miss. Uh, the first cohort's kicking my ass. Although this guy, they're about to die. It's like, you guys, 22, almost gone. There you go. Okay. Yeah, back off. Or actually, no. Uh, yeah, focus on the general. Infantry. Level to the general. The general's bodyguard's almost dead. The cone can get out of there. I don't want you to die. You need to get my general alive. So let's have you pull out. Everybody else will stay fighting. The enemy general yeah. is slain, and now his men there goes Hannibal Anus. It is time to press the attack. Okay, what's left? They've got one guy there, and they've got the first cohort guy. He's trying to fight. Wait, does he not have a weapon? He's just punching people. <laughs> This guy's seriously just punching people. He's that confident he's just punching people. Although technically I know he's trying to hit with an invisible sword. Okay, General, just get around him and charge him. He killed one of my men with his bare hands! What's left? They've got like one guy here? Uh, you guys don't, because I don't want you guys to kill them. 
literally just this one spearman who's just standing there. There we go. Victorious! A tribute to Roman strength and honor. When you're so strong, you just bitch them. That was a Chad amongst Chads. I just killed one of my men with his bare hands. Beautiful. But now, Western Rome is kicked out of Iberia. We now just need to actually advance on the, uh, on the Vandals. Victory and glory! Yeah, Carthago Nova is now mine. Perfect. I'm gonna hope that Lombardy up there actually does some more damage to the Vandals. That'd be nice. Okay, you guys are really unhappy up here. Why are you unhappy? Um, oh, they don't like how much Christianity is here. This is the capital. Religion differs from the official religion. Okay. Try and retrain everybody. Oh my god, we can get some good armor here. I love it. Okay, this place is already pissy. Let's just immediately get rid of the, uh... Yeah, let's just immediately get rid of this because it's already... They're already pissy. That only made a 10% difference. So we'll do that. And then you guys just lower the taxes and try... Oh, actually, that's perfect. Yeah, just lower the taxes. And then we can just slowly try and convert them. There. Lefistian has arrived. Actually, I think he killed two to three. He's a Giga Chad, or he was. If only I could recruit him into my ranks. If only. Lots of you guys. Uh, I, keep doing that. I just need to keep building up more of the stuff for churches. Let's see, how are you guys doing up here? Londinium. Oh, you guys stop dying! Okay, get the better walls. I don't have the best walls now that I can. You guys, um... Get the amphitheater. You guys get the better walls. And also, is that affecting across the water? No. Okay, so this actually doesn't convert across the water, which is great. Okay, well, at least you guys built that, uh, like, converted this one really quickly. You guys are a hell of a lot happier now. I love it. It's probably also due to the fact that we did kill a large part percent of the population. Um, I don't get why Empire Total War is the Total War game when you can't sack the settlement. Oh, because you have to be so prim and proper. <laughs> um, hey, Odra. RP a bit and pretending joined you? Oh, fuck yeah, I'm gonna RP that he joined me. What are we gonna nickname that, Chad? Like, if I can get... Uh, actually, he's gonna be the first Grail Knight I can recruit, we'll say. We, we improved of his work so much, we promoted him and made him, like, our first knight. I kind of like that idea. He, no, he joined in one of my legionnaires. Because I don't think I can get cohorts, which is kind of sad. No, I can just get legionnaires. Which is a shame. Let's see, uh, what have I missed? Uh, I may or may not have been popping to Hilgard over in... Lingen. Um, well, what you've missed so far is we've been able to actually build ourselves up and conquer most of Iberia. We need to get rid of the Vandals here. But we've actually been doing fairly well for ourselves. I'm tempted, because we can continue, we can push back the Vandals here. And then I might actually have us try and drop a force off up here. Try and conquer some stuff up here, because the Western Rome is doing pretty poorly up here right now, honestly. Might be a good chance to try and go take some of their lads. Chatimus Maximus, yes. Chatimus, uh, can I rename units? I don't think I can. Unit description. Damn it, I can't rename the Chatimus Maximus. But we're gonna, yes, Chatimus Maximus, first of his name, has joined up with our family, uh, with our uh, forces as he showed great prowess in the Battle of Carthago Nova. And he is going to be leading my legionnaires from henceforth. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Nothing else to build here. No. How much money are we making now? We are now making. If it wasn't for construction. Oh, actually, it's gonna be bad. To, it's gonna be skewed now. Oh, wow. Eastern Rome's kicking ass over here. Look at that. They're pushing back the Berbers. Oh, they did lose some land over here. Are you guys actually at war with assassins? Diplomatic standing. Yes. They're still allied to the East, Western Rome. Hmm. 
Hmm. Just kind of curious. What is that like for everybody else? So, like, here's me. These guys are dead. Are they still alive? Oh, no. How are the goths still alive? Okay. Uh, Sarmatians, I know, are still alive. Just hit everybody. Oh, the Vandals are allied to Western Rome. Fuck you. Franks are allied to the Vandals and to the Sassanids. Actually, Roxolani are allied with both the Romes. Huh. Okay. Ostrogoths are allied just to me. The Huns are at war with everybody. I almost wonder if I'd offer them an alliance. Slavs are just at war with a lot of people. You're just the one city. No allies. Out with the Franks. And these guys have one settlement left. I don't know how they're still alive, honestly. Biggest Chattius. I like Chattius Maximus, honestly. I sure if you kill him in the next same stream as you have given him the best name, I will unsubscribe. <laughs> uh, so technically what I'm going to view it is um, the, the, this guy right here. I'm going to consider this is Chattis Maximus. I wish I could rename him, but I can't. So what I'm going to do is just have it so the guy on the furthest left, my furthest left legionnaire, is Chattis Maximus and his legionnaires. That's what I'm going to consider because I can't actually have him in here. But, let's see, you guys just keep building these up. Money-wise... Okay, we're not making as much. We're making a little bit, but not a ton. I'm hoping that as population goes up, it'll get a little bit better, because I know we lost a lot over here, and so their overall income decreased. And that's the thing, he can't be killed. Biggest Dickus meets Biggest Chattis. He's Giga Chattis, uh, Maximus. He always wins. I, I wish I could rename my generals, because I'd rename, like, uh, a man of the hour as Chattis Maximus. I would totally do that if I could right now, but I don't think I'm able to. Wait, I need to have it so that what we're going to do is I'm going to try and build these forces up a little bit, and I'm going to try and see if I can take you guys out of... Ow. Out of, uh, Thrasso. Is that Thrasso or Thraco? I don't know if it's supposed to be a hard seat. But no, you guys... Oh, I love this armor. You guys have amazing armor now. How do you compare to normal legionnaires? Let's see, because you guys are a good example over here. Oh Jesus, that's a huge difference. I love it. I love it. Okay, because Cothago Nova, we are making right now about 1800. Oh, please don't. Please don't try and attack me here. I really hope you don't. I just built myself up around here, damn it. Ah, uh, please don't. What I think I'm gonna try and do... Do I have a diplomat around here? Let me get one. Let me try and get a diplomat. I'm gonna try and talk to you guys, and I'm hoping you won't attack me. Let's see, how long is left in the stream? Um, you can rename him in the folder. Ah, uh, will I be able to actually do that? I'm curious. Because I don't know if the, like, I know, like, if you spawn generals, technically you can. Um, I'm probably going to be going for maybe about another hour, roughly. It's kind of my expectation, is at least maybe about another hour. Oh, you guys are still alive here. Ready to um, sail. Let's bring you back down this way. Set I'll try and drain this. And I hope I can maybe try and talk to you guys. You're too far away. Honestly, can I just disband you? No. You have to die of old age before I can get rid of you. Because I don't want you guys to attack me right now. Please don't. Oh, you're walking close to my ship. Please stop that. Please stop. Awaiting your command. Let's try and talk to them. I think that it's a soft C, but I could be wrong. I believe ancient Latin did not have hard C until I brought it. Please feel free to correct me if I'm wrong. I know for myself, I'm not much to correct. Um, I just don't know if it what it is. Uh, let's see. We're making about 1,900. Basically, I'm gonna try and get three of you guys to watch over this city because they seem fairly happy already right now. I can upgrade the taxes a little bit here, quite a bit actually. I can go up to high right now. 
because I'd want to go. I want to go for you guys, but if I have to, I might try and defend against you guys. I'm not sure. Because I just got these areas. Please don't attack me, for the love of God. Is there any more trade here? No, that's not going to be any more trade. I'll just get the better farm then. Distance to capital and corruption. Because uh, I can't get the... I already have this. I can't get it better for more law to help with corruption. Let's see. I added the script of Rome Strike in 3 so I can get Roman and Ally cohorts. Limites and Shreya. And after the Roman uniforms. Ooh. Oh, that's nice. That sucks. You guys are just continue dying over there, aren't you? Vandals? Oh no shit. Of course you guys are doing that. Can I be of service? Make information. Broken their alliances. Declare their allies. Okay. Again, please don't attack me. Please, Lombard. I don't want to fight you. I want to try and ally with you guys if I can. Also, can you guys leave here? Ah, uh, it's pissy. If I lower the taxes, it should be good. Yeah, lower taxes, right? You guys are good. Uh, please get out of the way. Um, we should probably make our way to Cordoba. I should also get rid of you, Captain Decimus. The enemy. Actually, how bad is the other? That's it. So I'm gonna try that every once in a while. Some of you guys. Victory and glory. Yeah, you guys didn't lose too much. Okay. Please just don't attack me. People in flight, rocks lying into the Burgundy again. Oh my god. God, France is just all over the place. What's going on over here? I really do think I need to try and conquer up here. I just need to figure out what you guys are doing. A uh, reminder that everyone should join the Discord so we can chat after the stream. That's true. That is true. Ah, uh, you guys are making your way to fucking Cordoba. Get my way, guys. I dare you. I do not. Want. One alliance. Very demanding. Ah, <sighs> shit. Um... I'll offer to attack the Goths. We see no benefit to us. They're gonna siege it. They're so gonna siege my shit here. Let's have you get some legionnaires. Please don't attack me. I swear to God. You guys. Just get the, yeah, just get the arena up here, Londinium. You're still building that. You guys can actually do something now. Although, let's do something in Delradia, Delradia first. Because you guys are a little unhappy. Um, get that improvement. You're already on low taxes. Um. Just get another dude. Just get another dude to watch over there, and then you guys... Ah, uh, just get that. For more public order. So I don't think I have a voice for that team. Well, you don't have to do it right now. Uh, I'll for them. Seriously, where are the gods? Where are the gods at? Because I don't see them anywhere. Because <laughs> here are the Ostrogoths. They're almost dead. Burgundy... Franks, Berber. Why are the Berbers all the way up here? Um, Sarmatians. Like, it says the Goths are still- Oh, wait, 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 wait. I think this is it. This one man is all that remains of the Goths. He is going bold. He is trying to take Constantinople. Ah, oh, please don't. I was hoping to get inside the city first. Sir, Please don't. Please don't. 
go Nova. You guys also try and get some Legionnaires. I think they're gonna split their attention. Looking for Goss, looking in the shadows. Yeah, I'll try and build up some forces around here. General. If I can get in here and defend, I'm, I'm just gonna focus on defending the city center next time that this happens when we have stay assault. We just built ourselves up and now they're attacking me. I don't want a war with you assholes. Ceasefire? Can I get a ceasefire, please? Our patients surely you just. I don't want a war with you. Now, now they're just surrounding me. Orders. Uh. Let's withdraw. I don't think it's going to be smart for me to sit here. If I would have been able to get there beforehand, I think we could have done something, but I'm just going to have to let them take Cordoba. Well, let's see how this goes. We'll try and defend it. I'm just going to go to the city center and just try and hold that spot and see what happens. Because they should take some damage from the towers. And hopefully, if I can weaken them, I can come back and kill them all. Just right now, because they've just got a bunch of hordes, I can't do anything. Which just bugs me. And that's the one thing I just don't like about, bar about Barbarian Invasion. It's hard to kill a faction off. It's very difficult to kill a faction off. They stand alone! No friend has come to this place Saladin. to die for them! Does this not say something about their honor? They're standing among nations? Behind these city walls, we must make our stand. These people have no other defenders. And if we fail, then we will pay the price. Slavery, rape, and pillage will be their fates, if they are lucky. We must keep them safe. That is the warrior's way. They seem keen to throw their lives away in an assault. Well, it would only be polite to send them to the afterlife. If you only count numbers, then things look black. But even if victory seems far hey, away, they will know that they have been in a fight. Zeke, Zeke, I'm we sure. will hurt them. These people have never fought us before. Let us shock them so much that they never wish to fight us again. I'm hoping we can do that because this is, is not no going to be a fun shame fight. In fear. I'll have to there hope that the towers can do a decent amount of damage. I'm Try fine, to you. Look scared, hope you too. And you'll not too bad, not too bad. Besides heart. the fact that this horde is about to destroy my goddamn city. So, oh my god. Oh, Jesus Christ. They all have siege equipment. Every last fucking one of them. Oh god. Um, we are fucked. We are so fucked. I'm gonna do this. We're gonna sit in a triangle. We're gonna just sit in a triangle in the city center and just see what the fuck happens. Because, oh my god, are we so fucked. They have 9,000 men. Almost 10,000 men. Oh my god. Okay. We got this. <laughs> we got this. We can, we can hold. Uh, let's see. Do you know if there the will be a preload? Uh, I'm assuming there the should be a preload. I'm assuming there will be. Okay, they're losing some men from the towers. Good, good. Lose as many as possible, please. When the game is like, you're doing so well. Uh, so we've got a hundred. The enemy have formidable siege towers. How many guys do you think are gonna die Prepare from the for some hard fighting. We literally just have the city center. We've got our triangle. The enemy have taken them. Oh, this is nice. Please just don't take that many towers. Please be shot at a lot. They've almost lost 300 guys already, actually. That's something. That that's something. Okay, okay. Uh, I'm just waiting for my inevitable doom. Because <laughs> they bring nine thousand men to bear on four hundred and fifty. Oh my god! Please break a lot. Like please have horrible morale as you walk inside the city. It's going decently so far. They've lost three percent. Give about five hundred men at max before they get in. Well, so far, they've almost lost 300. 
Oh shit, what have I missed now? <laughs> um, well, what you missed is the fact that uh, Burgundy decided to attack us. And... I had three guys. They want their fucking parking lot back. And now, uh... Here they come. So most of them are coming from the north. I'm actually gonna kind of look more over here. So I'll slow this down a little bit. Because here they come. Here comes the horde raiders. They've got all their skirmishers. They're rare. They're, they're, they're all their cavalry. They're very tired. Which makes me hope that maybe they'll break. Because my guys are in the city center. We should have unlimited morale. And I'm in a hope that their morale is horrendous. If it is, maybe we can do... Like, this guy's broken! We lost uh, four guys, five guys for that. And then they're broken. No, they're fighting to the death, it seems. Oh god, how's this gonna go? Okay. Uh, this is going well. What the fuck? We've lost 400 guys. I've lost 10. <laughs> If we can keep that ratio up... Oh, here comes the skirmishers now. Uh, that's not what I want. If the cab's breaking... That's something. I can't do anything against the skirmishers. I really can't, so I'm just trying to sit here. I'm not moving. I'm holding this triangle! You're doing surprisingly well. They are breaking! <laughs> If I win this, this will be hilarious. We lost about 40 guys. They've now lost about 600. If they keep breaking like this, if the cab is not happy, you hold the horse parking lot. No, they're not. Like, if their guys keep doing this, I might win. This is working right now. Yes! I just have to survive for 30 minutes. That's all I have to do. Is this gonna fucking work? <laughs> like, I'm not losing that many guys. Not actually. They lost 47, 48. They've lost now about 800 guys. Oh, they're attacking from another angle now. They're firing from another angle now. Okay. Uh, I think I may have spoken too soon. They're breaking my formation. They've now lost a thousand guys. Okay. Battle of 300 2.0. Fuck yeah. I mean, if it worked in Warhammer for me, it would be... Well, the thing is, I just don't have... Like, their archers are my main concern. Um, their archers can do a lot of damage to me. And if the archers just start unloading on me, because they have a lot of archers, uh, I'm gonna die. If they keep just going in with their infantry and cavalry, we might actually be fine. I just need to delay. And they've now lost over a thousand guys so far. Like, this is surprisingly the work. And I love it. Like, this I don't like. They're warmed up. They're technically well. They're messing up my triangle, which I don't like. I'm gonna have to try and adjust it. Differently. As it took a second, but I think I can make sense of what's happening now. I got too used to modern Total War. <laughs> okay, I need to adjust my triangle. And I hope this doesn't fuck me up. We're gonna try and adjust my triangle. Damn it! And now he feeds well, thankfully we're in the city center, so it shouldn't matter. His men may soon be bird food too. Lost half my army now. Uh, I think this is where it's gonna fail now. No, now they're just surrounding me. Damn it! We did well though. I made them lose fifteen hundred guys. I don't know if I should have adjusted my triangle. But I made them bleed for that. Attacked, but our Roman glory lies in tatters after this defeat. Not bad. Uh, what difficulty do I play on? This is on very hard, very hard. 
Ugh, oh, that actually did pretty decently. We held way better than I was expecting to there. Made them lose like 1,300 guys. Now, if only I would have been able to actually have enough time to get my reinforcements here, we could have destroyed them. Imagine if I would have had an octagon instead of a triangle. <laughs> okay, so you guys took Cordoba, which I hate. Lose your damn... General. Do I have enough... Can I get some mercenaries? I can. General. If I... If I kill you... Imperator. Just you, they should die. Uh, did they tweak any of the morale bonuses in City Squares for the remaster? I don't believe so. I believe it's always been that you get unlimited morale in City Centers. And so I don't think they did. Okay, so, let's see. There are a few things I can do. Um... Imperator. I could take the city back. And just... Imperator. Like, if I kill you, I'm gonna get people to just walk into the city. Sir. And then try and force them into another defensive siege, where with this army, and the fact that we've got Conan on our side, we should be fine. I think we're gonna attack you. Because just this army, I think we should be able to beat you. Then, with these guys dead, we can just walk into the city, take it back, and then hopefully they try and attack it again. Because that should work out much better if I have an actual... If I have more men and actually have some skirmishers. Because still, killing that many, almost 1,400 guys with just three units of infantry, that was great. That was absolutely great. Hello. Today we are gathered here to do battle. Why does my guy sound drunk? But sometimes, you know, life is like that. He sounds fucking drunk. You do something you don't want to do. Just because someone is telling you to do it. I didn't want to be here myself, but then my mother told me that I'd better make a reasonable show of it all. So here we go. <laughs> On this field stand one in four of our I, Okay, this warriors. is my favorite speech we so far. Then, this is my favorite one. And do great he sounds fucking drunk. He's like, my mother just told more, me to be here. No be, make yourself you presentable. I love that. That's great. That's great. Because he's Roman Wine's one hell of a drug. Okay, so. So all of you guys. And all of you. Perfect, I can't move him in a block. Well, he is drunk. He lost his city. He's going to be drunk. Okay, let's make sure you guys have skirmish mode on. Defensive mode on. And the archers. Uh, I should have maybe waited so I can see better. This is hard to see. Okay, because what I'm going to do is with you guys... Let's actually line them up. A bit thicker of a line. Archers, like so. Have a lot of cavalry. I wonder if you guys can chill in the back for now. Now start the battle. And see if you guys are going to advance on. I can barely see. Wow, I should have waited. Ah, uh, the old military strategy of alcohol and psychedelics before battles. <laughs> well, of course! So I'm mainly just worried about your cavalry. Once your cavalry's done, this army is gonna get wrecked. Because you guys have- these horde units are pretty meh. Like, these horde spear things are just wrecked. They're like peasants, basically. Eh, yeah, we're- are we kinda of downhill, then? No, we're kind of even on them. Okay, I wonder if you guys run this way a little bit. Kid learned something from the druids. <laughs> I thought he was whisking Ruby. I guess it's over here. It's one of the horde hunters. Okay. But okay, I'll kind of bring you guys around and let's try and start charging some of these guys. I should be able to easily break some of these hordes. Because once their cav is dead, then I'm not going to worry too much. Also, this should be Shadimus Maximus here. Um, is this unit right here. So I wonder if we need to make sure he stays alive. Get our cab running along this way. Number wise, we got it. Actually, General, stay back here. I've got plenty of archers, General, uh, sorry, plenty of cavalry, but you can kind of stay here and make sure that we're just being 
washed over properly. You guys just go charge into this shit. I don't know, that's gonna be fun. Ah, it's actually pretty good. He's held that, actually. Ah, uh, nope, now you're breaking. Okay, perfect. Okay, you guys, let's move forward a little bit. There. And then Cav, kind of back. There he goes. Because some of the guys are already breaking. I need to get my skirmishers close enough to fire on you guys to return the fire. Now you guys are gonna follow me. General, get back over here. I'm gonna actually have you help out against this unit. Just trying to run away from them for a little bit. Because General, if you can get over here, we can easily kill this guy. And you guys are it's impetuous right now. Come on, don't break guys. Wait until the general gets there at least. Because he should be able to help turn that. You guys are getting some good hits here. There we go. Oh, this is the enemy general too. This is no way for a leader to behave, but in battle, it's beyond belief. The gods be praised. Yep, he's dead. The enemy general is dead. His men know their doom see, approaches. That, that is a hunter. Let's go kill him. As long as at this point, uh, actually wait. Let's charge with these guys. You should be able to break them. I need to go back and help my infantry over there, actually. Steady, and then they start losing a bunch of dudes. You should break. I don't expect this unit to hold. Wavering. Come on, break proper. There we go. Okay, I need to get out of here now at this point. Oh no, these guys aren't breaking. Perfect. Okay, Cap, can I get out of there, please? Let's go regroup with our units. Um, let's see. Quite literally how the Celtics, Celts did war with the Eons before the Romans arrived. Let's see. Then you won't fear being opened up physically by the enemy. It makes a hell of a lot of sense. Uh, isn't that like the whole story behind, uh, because I know there was like that one berserker that like held a bridge and it was just primarily because he was on a bunch of fucking psychedelics as well. Are you guys just withdrawing? Yes, they are. You are all running. I can't let you get away. I can't let you guys get away. Otherwise, you'll just go into the city. And I can't let that happen. So let's put you guys up. We should be able to just do one unit per dude. And then easily be able to run you guys away off the map. So I can't let you get back into the city. Oh, my guys are breaking. Get out of there, General. I need you all focus on the same unit, probably. Uh, they're gonna get back in the city. That was a Viking you were thinking about. Stammer Bridge, I believe. Yes. I can't remember if it was a Barbarian or if it was a Viking. I just know he was a bit psyched up on a bunch of stuff and held, like, what was it, against, like, 800 men? Yeah, Sanford Bridge, he was a man of skill war, but he was hoping to kill hope shrew magic, and I think he was Norseman. Uh, if he was Danish, then it was... Yeah, we can the city, and I hate that. The... <sighs> this is a so you guys are gonna survive. Don't go into the city, please. So you got spear butt in the balls by anglo Saxons. Wait, what? Oh god, that's not a good way to go. You guys are gonna go back into the city now, aren't you? Please don't. Please don't run away into the city. Damn it! Victory and glory! Ah, uh, okay. Well, there goes that plan. So, we're gonna have to pull back. I'm gonna have you some more reinforcements over here, though. Honestly, let's some more. Yeah, send some more. You guys too, maybe? Uh, all Vikings are barbarians, but not all barbarians are Vikings. 
Because now you guys are just going to be able to freely... I was hoping to kill you guys all off. I hate how the AI does that in Rome. They're more likely to just try and run away and just withdraw off the map. It's such a pain in the ass. Also, I'm going to get rid of you. You're an expensive unit, and I don't need you to there to garrison that city. Okay. Body. Yeah, you took my land, assholes. I'm taking it back. I'm not going to let you hold it. Yeah, that's what happened. He held the bridge, giving the Norsemen time to repair a shield wall because the intersection surprised them. Oh, you guys fucked off. Orders. Oh. Well. Alright. Um. I'm just gonna resiege my shit. Yeah, bring in some siege towers. Just do that. If I can take it back, I'm gonna hope I can maybe lure them back this way. I might be able to repeat that same defense up there. It is less. There are less of them. Might be able to hold that. You get another legionnaire over here, please. If you have time, I might try and get an archer for you. General. But I'm hoping we can kill them off over here and I can get my land back. Let's see. Um, what are you doing? Oh, actually, this is the diplomat. I was trying to see if they give me peace, but I'm not going to do that right now. I want my land back. Leave me alone, Vandals. Let us end the Oh, you guys actually want a ceasefire. Sure. Oh, I'll accept that for now. Would you guys now like to trade? Mm. I'll kill curious, you eventually, but for now, I'll take a ceasefire. Let us now talk reasonably. Okay, you guys also want a ceasefire. That all except for now, too. I'll trade with you as well. A most generous proposal. I have. I'm not in the uh, place where I can actually kill you off right now. Should be able to just auto resolve seat, this, honestly. Imperator. Yeah, we can take. Victory and glory. Yeah, run away, get out of my lands, fuck off. This is my lands. Now stay out of them. Now, so train my guys. Get rid of the mercenaries too at this point. There we go. Okay, so we've got my land back. Um, ooh, you guys can actually get this version. Do I want to grab that? I'm actually curious if there's anything. I need money. Yes, grab that. There's a lot of corruption. Holy shit. Um. I have nothing to get rid of that corruption. Jesus. Okay, well, let's get the better roads, too. Grab that. Let's see, how, many, how much time are we doing on time? We're at 2 hours and 23 minutes. Oh, I'm not going to rotate that. Go back to normal. There we go. Perfect. You guys... Is this port seriously not going to get you anything? Or I just have no trade routes that are close enough? I do not. Okay, just get some better farms, then. Do that, and then now let's go try and talk to you guys and see if you give me peace. I will address them at once. I'm gonna hope you guys attack the vandals. Please do. Please attack the vandals so I can take the land from you guys. Oh hey, the Ostrogoths are alive again over here. They've taken Massilia. Honestly, I should maybe go take Corallus. You have a general over there. I could do that. Um, do I actually have any navy units left? I have you guys. Let's see. I should train you. And then I can try and bring you guys around this way. I might do that. Maybe conquer that. Or I could also just take out the Burbs. The Burbers. I don't think you guys can be ban- Oh. Uh, I don't think you guys can try and become uh, a horde. So taking that land might not be a bad idea. And also, if we're kind of going with the whole, um... Jokingly making us, like, the British Empire really early on. Hey, I have to control the Strait of Gibraltar, too. We still have to go conquer and take out, um... The Suez Canal at some point. Honestly, I'm going to go take King Tingi. I think I'm going to do that. Because right now, as long as I can kind of sit here as I am, I think we'll be okay. Let's bring you guys over this way. Keep retraining them. And then I am going to need more ships. So I'll start trying to get a better navy around here. How much money are we making right now? 7,000? Seriously? 
Oh, wow. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Yeah, because you guys... Oh, I can get something here. You uh, get the better mine. Mine will get a nice, what, 150 increase? Yeah. 150 increase. Basically only 100 because of the corruption. And then what about you guys up here? Ah, uh, should I try and convert one of you guys now? This area is happy. And it's been converted. Maybe I should try and convert Dalradia next? Let's try and get you guys a few more uh, units in case they uh, attack us and or if they revolt. So let me try and get some random dudes here and then just try and get more stuff for public order. So like this is some more law. Grab that. Tara. Uh, the aqueduct. I'll just get the aqueduct. And actually, no. Uh, yeah, lose, lose money. Grab that. Homeland. Ah! Okay, so they're over there. Also, I'm curious, what is my family tree? I've lost a lot of family members, so let's kind of see. Family tree. I wish I could kind of zoom out. It's a little better. Now there's actually some people. Also, I kind of find it hilarious. We have, like, a Septimus, Septimus uh, family line. Now you guys are doing decently. Okay, there's not nearly as many deaths now. There's a lot of them still, but not as bad. Ah, uh, yes, I know I have an inactive diplomat. You can't do anything! I've literally talked to, like, everybody. I have no more trade to be made. And it looks like... Okay, you guys are now actually getting your asses kicked by assassinates. You're now being pushed back. Okay, well, you're holding out, kind of. Um, let's see where's that Okay, you guys come down this way. I'm gonna try and get some better ships, uh, better units, and then we're gonna try and take Tinky. Try and kill off the Berbers. Hopefully, I'm not going to piss off Eastern Rome, because I don't want to fight them just yet. We're going to fight them eventually, but not yet. There we go. Let's see. Keep building that up. You keep building that up. Yeah, because I want to try and take you guys, and then I think we'll go over and maybe take... Uh, oh, uh, yeah, I am at war with you, so I can kind of go try and take over this area. They've got that one dude. He's probably not going to survive, but he might. Continuum, building, building, building. Yeah, you just need to keep getting more guys. I'll recruit for about four turns in case they have somebody where they try and revolt here. And then I'll start trying to convert you guys to Christianity. I, I know you are an inactive diplomat. Oh, another family member died. Okay. Hi, Vandals. Can we please actually be at peace? Except for we all attack, give us 770 denials. No! Until next time. I'm not going to do that. You can fuck right off. Oh, look at that. They're bringing more guys. Uh, okay, well, let's get Legionnaire there. I might fight them instead. No need to attack Tinky. I could take you guys right now, though. I honestly could. Um, oh no, Conan's getting old. He's 50 now. Let's take you guys. I'm gonna go try and take this. So, Cordoba. Boom, boom. Get some guys' free upkeep. So you can't have on. I'm late, but hi, anyways. Hey, Flower Power. How's it going, man? Ready to sail. Uh, can I disembark? Oh, I can't disembark this turn. Damn it. Okay, we'll wait until Ready next turn. Sail. I'll drop you guys off, and then we'll try and take Tinky. Because you guys just try and get some more dudes. You guys should be okay. Um, hit that. You guys are getting the mine right now. And I have nothing else to build here? No. Okay. Uh, ooh, another suitable husband. I'll take you. For the most part. Like, there's no reason to really ever reject them in Rome. Where'd you... Okay, you were put in London. Londinium. Vandals are going to try and attack me. I just know they're going to try to. Please don't. Our patience is limited. You guys want to cease fire? Actually, I'm going to try and ask you guys to make a payment. Make a single payment. I'm going to ask for... 1,000 dinar. Demand I'm so in trouble. I thought I'd at least try.
Are you thinking of doing anything, Vandals? You better not. Let me try. Let me look. I'm making 7,000 a turn right now. Like, that's way more than I thought I was going to be making. So let's have you guys get um, another another British Legionnaire. I'll have two British Legionnaires, and I'll have some archers there. You guys can now drop off. Hi, guys. Yes, I'm attacking you, Berbers. I know. Uh, couldn't you have gone away a different angle so that I could have taken the city this turn? Would have loved if you did that. Um, let's have you guys get the mine. You guys can't do anything. Nothing, nothing. Two more turns for you, so I'm gonna have you guys get... Um, let's get some... Another archer unit, and then I'll say... Maybe no, no, just two more archers. In case they revolt. I mean, I hope they don't. Reject the not horny ones. As you see fit, Flower. I shall do so from now on. Oh, the goth! The goth actually to did it. That fucking mad lad took Constantinople. He actually did that. The fucking mad lad. That is hilarious, <laughs> bro. This is what zero pussy in a hundred regiment does to another. I find it hilarious that the goths actually won there. That is hilarious. Okay, well, let's start sieging Tingy. Besieging settlement, sir. I'm gonna... Yeah, we'll sit... Yeah, there. Uh, two and two. Well, just one. There. Settlement so I'll just sit there for one seat, turn. Sir. Then we can take that. You guys should be good on defenses, I think. Keep eating the cathedral. I'm gonna get some archers, because the archers are pretty cheap. I'm pretty. Just in case you guys decide to attack here. I, I love that that one guy, they let that one guy get away with that. I'm not gonna ask. Maybe he's Chat he's related to Chatimus Maximus. He might be. He somehow took Constantinople on his own. <laughs> I don't know how he did it, but I'm gonna commend him for it. Let's see. Okay, one more turn and then I'll start trying to convert this area. I think I can get rid of some. I don't have any ships around here. That's just the issue. Londinium, you're... Actually, I never train these guys. Okay. Go train them. You too. Yes, I know I have an inactive div man. He's not going to do anything. Oh, hi, Vandals. Ooh, look who... Who look decided to drop by. No shit. Well, I'm going to hope... What I did in Car uh, Cordoba is gonna work here. I've got a little bit better. I've got four dudes, and I've got a archer. So I'm gonna hope you guys can hold at least long enough for me to take this. Which, honestly, I think you. And you guys can't become barbarians, can you? I don't think you can. It's not a barbarian, it's a horde. Nope, they can't. Berbers are dead. There we go. One less faction. Okay, you guys are already actually 100% Christian, which is interesting. Okay, that works in my favor. Okay, then all I need to try and do to make sure you guys are happy. Don't have a call standing to you. No, they don't. Okay, well, let's grab that. And then I just need to rec start recruiting some guys around here to defend the city. Or actually, let's have Cordoba just to grab these guys. Yes, Captain. So, bring these two over. Hopefully that'll be enough that they'll be happy. And then I can bring these guys up, bring them into Cordoba, retrain them. And then if you guys fail to hold this city, I'll bring them over and we'll kick back the Vandals. Because I think at this point we can start trying to advance on them proper and start pushing up here. Because I tried to give them peace, but they decided to say fuck off. Ah, uh, London's unhappy. London's unhappy. Let's get another unit. You guys... Get a forum. Yeah, yeah, definitely do that. Get the forum. Now you guys, okay, so now you're going to be pretty unhappy. But we're going to start converting them. So where'd it go? Oh, god damn it, I did the same thing. I never converted it in the first place. So now let's try and lower the taxes. It's already low. Um, daily games, that's better. 
Hopefully you guys will last. Just get some more infantry in case. Try and do that. Slowly but surely we're converting everybody. Okay, you guys get the better farm. Do that. What's going on here? I know I have inactive diplomats. Action destroyed purpose. And then, hey, uh, a merchant joined me actually. Nice. How much money are you making right now? You're making 52. I think I can find something that's more worth your time. Like... Uh, wasn't there... I thought there was a good trade node down here, wasn't there? Potential trade income. Camels? Is that what you're referencing? Oh, no, here it is. Try and go get them, man. Try and go get them. Where'd you go? Yeah, go over that way. See if you can do that. He's going to ever attack me? I'll have to see. Okay, diplomatic information. Yep, I know I'm over them again. At least this time I suck the uh, Lombardies on them, so these guys can kind of keep them busy a little bit. Okay, turn again. Uh, I don't know if Tinky's going to be happy enough for me to leave this turn. Um, let's see. Right now you're unhappy because of distance to capital and... Culture Bentley. Uh, okay, well... I'm gonna have you sit here, retrain some guys, recruit some more, and then I'll drop these guys off here. I'm pretty sure you guys are gonna be pissing. Yep, it's at zero. Mmm, yes. Uh, I can lower the tax rate, and that's it. Brings it to 30. I have to at least sit here a little bit, so... We'll try and sit here, just retrain during that time. Cordoba. Get the Roman Basilica. You guys are still sieging me here. Are you guys ever going to attack? Please do. Oh, uh, please don't tell me you're going to attack here too. Let's get an archer. Try and hold that. I almost want to be able to bring an army down from up here, but I don't think I can right now. If you guys don't fully revolt. I can try and do that. And I can try and bring this force from up here. So kind of like retrain those guys. Get some more men. I can try and basically yeah, bring these guys down. Maybe try and take this city again. So remember Fowler made us sign a contract? Go chase. I remember. Riding. Come on, Vandals. I want you to attack me, guys. I want to see if we can win that this time. Aha! Here it is. Okay, so, this time we got a little bit more men, and maybe, maybe we can hold this. We're gonna go into the city center, and I have to make a square. Or maybe I can make, I don't know, it depends if they're gonna assault from just one angle. If they all come from one angle, I think I can easily try and just hold them back. Just make a really nice, good line. Because I actually have a archer here this time, so we're not gonna have to worry about that same issue as before. But going to the city center, and then sitting there and letting them tire themselves out, I think we might be able to hold. It's kind of destroyed my triangle last time, and that's why it failed. But I think it's too I'm getting a little hungry, so we might not go for too much longer. The city's people look to us to save them. If we are to keep them from slavery, rape, and slaughter, then we must hold firm. Yes, I, I know that, no Damien. It, no it weakness. scares me. If needs be, this is where we die. But it will not come to that. We shall fight like true warriors and prevail. Come on, let's do this. Let's do our men, our men proud. So they're all coming from the same direction. And that means that they should all be coming from this side. I'm going to hope. So let's do this. Big blob. And I'm going to try and kind of be like this. We'll make a little box. Kind of. Hopefully they just won't surround, try and surround us. And if they just come from this one angle, I think we can hold. Is everybody on be on guard position? Turn skirmish mode off. Okay. Let's go. Let's see how you guys are going to hold this time. Just you guys need to defend our flanks from Cav. As long as they don't try and fully surround us, I think we might be able to hold this. Just have to see how many men they're going to lose on the towers. 
Still gonna number us four to one. The Ram's destroyed. That's good. I wish we could destroy one of the siege towers. What are you doing? The enemy have formidable siege towers at the walls. Prepare for so some So far, they've lost four. That's off to a great start. Okay. Also, this looks great. I want to, like, just look in here. We're probably going to die anyways. Oh, man, there's actually some decent detail in here. Inside the Colosseum. Not bad. Yes, I'm going to dick about looking at other things, because right now, myself... Yeah, we're just getting our ass kicked. Let's see. You should play as Romano British and Attila after this. Maybe. I'll have to see what the people are wanting are no after this. Because I know when we start, I'm going to start trying them. to have it so that... Um, basically, I want to have like one main campaign that we focus on for a long time. Right now, that's Ireland. And then another campaign that's kind of a little shorter. Something a little bit more focused on like what our goals are. With this one, like right now, we just want to conquer Iberia, France, and England. That's all we want. And then that's going to be done with us for here. And then I just kind of have to kind of see what people want me to do after that. Like, what campaign or what mod should we kind of do, go into? I'm assuming more people might want me to just continue playing more uh, Rome Remaster at this moment. With how uh, recent it is. Hey, oh, Diego. How's it going, man? What are you guys doing? We lost about 70 guys. And I don't know what they're trying to do. They've wasted almost a third of the battle timer so far. Off to a good start, I'd say. I'm just curious if they're going to keep this up. I'm hoping they do. Because they didn't take this gateway, thankfully. It's just one lone dude is walking forward. Is that it? Like, so far you guys are making this a pretty easy fight for me. What are you guys doing? Like, they've got some guys over here. Oh, well, they might try and surround us. Okay, we still wait. So they might be bringing some guys over here, maybe. So how are you guys doing? I know you're standing in the rain. And, uh, might suck a little bit, but hey, we... we we're fighting a bunch of idiots so far, it seems. We've almost wasted half of the battle. <laughs> Just waiting on them to come back here. This one unit's almost here. Might get a fight in a second. Where's this unit? Ah, oh, there they are. So they're kind of slowly walking in with, like, one guy at a time. Ah, they didn't fully rush in. So they did take their time. So they're not tired, actually. They're pretty fresh still. You guys feel like you're wavering already. Archers train back up as they keep pushing you back. I'd like you to break, please. Oh, here comes another unit. I'm gonna slow this down. So what I'm gonna do, since I don't see any other cabs just yet, move you over here and try and attack this guy. Let's see, general. Horn. We are in the city center, so it shouldn't matter too much. Okay, Jason's in a battle against 10,000 Macedonians. Nice. How's that going, man? You guys feel like you're losing, huh? You guys feel like you're losing, nice. Um, may I ask if the game is well optimized for multi-core? Um, it feels like it is. I have a multi-core myself. Um, I have an AMD, uh, Ryzen. And so, I, I've got, like, what, eight cores? It feels like it's fairly optimized for multiple cores. Like, I haven't, I've had very minimal staggering in this so far. Oh, don't tell me you're actually bringing a guy behind me. Fuck! That unit's exhausted, at least. I'm gonna hope that I can kill them. I don't like that they're actually trying to surround me. God, I forgot how much ammo you have in Rome. Holy shit. So far, we've killed about 500 guys losing 150 of Okay, come back over here. Right there. Look at the 
One from the front, left, left front. I like DMD. I, I've always tried giving them a chance. Although I know for myself, um, there's some stuttering I get on my computer just in general that I think might be related to my processor, and I'm gonna try and get Intel next time I get an upgrade. I just know at the time it was a bit easier for me to get a uh, AMD than another Intel. Far so good. This is going well. They've lost now about 700 guys. Archers can go around. As long as I keep sending one guy at a time, I can just move my archers around and get some nice kills. Legionary cohort kind of move forward. You guys again try and reform this formation. Archers go around. I don't see anybody else around here, right? Nope, they still haven't moved forward. Oh, is everybody else outside Cav? No, that's actually their skirmishers. They've only got 18 minutes left. Open fire on these guys now. Let's go back here. There we go. Fire again. This is going wonderfully. Um, next time I'll actually have another archer because I intended to have two. Come on, break, please. Wavering. Come on. I'm hoping after this, oh, I've got another guy coming. Get away from that unit. Go right here. There we go. Almost out of ammo. I have lost one of my spearmen. One of my spearmen has died. Go around here again. My archers are the goddamn MVPs of this battle so far. Because they're not breaking as easily as the other guys. These units actually have some decent armor. But they are slowly advancing one at a time, thankfully. That's their step spearmen. As soon as they start sending their archers, that's when I think we've got this. Because then it's just those guys will easily break in melee, or they should. Ah, oh, damn it, they sent another one around! I'm almost out of ammo now, which is gonna scare me. Kills you guys done. I can't tell right now. No, don't tell me that was my general. Damn it! Okay, well, we now just have to see what we can do in melee with all of this. We've used up every ounce of ammunition. We killed 1,200 men. Now, can we hold is the question. I think we're gonna lose this now. Damn it! If I would have had one more archer like I wanted, we almost had this. What the hell is that? Okay. A defeat. So many good Romans have died for no. Almost. But from this, we got 460 kills with that archer. If I would have had one more archer, one more, that we could have done that. I think. Well, I'm going to be coming back with some more forces, and we will reclaim that, for sure. I at least gave them hell for that city. Yeah, defending the city center is so much easier in Rome than it is in Medieval. I think it's because the city center is so massive. So don't worry, Vandals. I'm going to be coming for you. Now I just have to hope you guys don't take Salamantica. That's my one hope, is that you guys aren't able to do that. Tingy, can I have you guys leave here? Okay, are they good? Uh, that's at 50%. I can't lower the tax rate anymore. Cultural penalty is the main issue right now. I'm 
hoping you guys can hold. I need to move out of here. That's the thing. I just need to move out. And so, let me just try and get some archers. I need to bring you guys up and around to try and reclaim Cortego Nova. Yeah, get back up here. Uh, you guys, let's get a, another archer, because we'll at least have the one unit from the end turn. See if we can hold that. And then how are you guys doing up here for conversion? Because once you guys are converted, I can move all these guys down. Eh, not the best. It's better. It's better. You're not rioting. You're not constantly rioting, at least. You guys, um, let's get the better barracks. I should have gotten the better barracks here a while ago, anyways. So the husband, I'll accept him. Where is he? He's in one game. Okay. Cordoba, okay. let's have you actually recruit me some more. Give me another legionnaire. General. Actually, maybe another cav unit actually instead. No, legionnaire first, then I can get the cav unit after that instead. Uh, hope you put the city's toilet seats up. That would be evil. We <laughs> want. Yes, I know you're an active diplomat. I have nothing for you to do. Yep, here they come. Let's see if we can hold you guys at bay. Honestly, I'm going to try and ignore them at that city and see if we can actually get the other one. Ah, oh, did you not get it? My oh, man. Failed by out attempt. Damn it. Okay. See, Tingy's unhappy. Ah. See, it's the fact. Ah, uh, I'll take you. Oh, and is he in Cordoba? Yes, he is. Okay, perfect. So then I can actually have you try and go... Yes, Captain. Yes, Captain. Okay. Go try and watch over that city. Maybe they'll be a bit better with you. Um, I'll have you move forward. And let's see. Oh, well, actually, do I want you to go to... Orders. Hmm. I think you need more men. Because you're down how many guys? Six units. What kind of mercenaries are there around here? I can get these guys, which actually gets most of what I need. So let's get two more archers, and then I think you're good here. I need a full stack if I'm going to fight these guys. So let's grab that. You keep going over to Tingy. Prepare that stuff, and then let's start replacing some of the stuff to get rid of the cultural penalty. Um, let's grab the... It's going to take six turns either way on anything. Try and get the better army barracks, we'll say. Try and do that. Because otherwise, I can just get that. Cultural penalty is the main issue. Three turns. No, let's do that. Better roads. That'll replace the roads at least there. And hopefully you're able to get here before they revolt and just kill everybody. I'll get another archer here and train all those guys. No. Where might I have you guys go first? I might have you go over here first and get rid of this army. I might have you do that. See if they can hold Salamantica on their own. They might be able to. They might not. How are you guys doing up here? Better. Better. Much better. Currently at 45%. Imperator. How are you guys if I take almost all of these guys outside? Ah, uh, you're good. Okay, I'm actually going to start moving you guys down to Londinium then. I'm going to try and attack this city. But let me do one more end turn, and then I think for myself, I'm actually going to be done for now. I'm no, I'm getting pretty hungry, and we're getting close to three hours. And so I think what we'll do, because with this now, you guys are just about ready with this army. Kind of curious on what's going on. If I can get one more dude, I'm going to attack them at Carthago Nova, I think. But I think I'm going to be done for now. Thanks, guys, for stopping by for this stream. I will be doing another one of this campaign on next Sunday, and I'm going to be going back to my Ireland one next Saturday. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this, and this is Rampant, and I'll see you guys next time.